Uh, happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Um, give me just a second. I'm just finishing up some stuff. <sighs> I did a baby group logo. Oh, Lego set. Girl, logo, Lego, Legos. I don't know. Um, dude, that sounds cool. I've always wanted to do one. I have seen quite a few cool ones, um, but I don't have a ton of space in my current apartment. So I'm like, ah, I should probably wait until I get a house and then go from there. Um, I don't know if I've told you guys, but I am actually going to have to move this year. <clears throat> So I've been kind of a little stressed looking for where to live and whatnot. Um, I would like to hopefully buy a house, but it's just so hard. It's so hard. Everything is so expensive right now. Um, I don't know if it's going to be possible for me to do that, but um, I definitely want to try. I want to try in North Carolina. Yeah, I'll still be in North Carolina. Um, I just have to move yeah the market right now isn't great unfortunately um but my thing is rent is extremely expensive right now like really 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 expensive um well you're moving 2k really moving to a town how am i sure yeah yeah it's stressful it's stressful um over here i don't know how much it is over there for you guys but over here it is really really expensive to rent um and i'm like well if it costs about the same to rent as it is to buy like maybe i can find something you know small and affordable that maybe i could move into instead that's at least mine maybe but i don't know i've been looking um and it's just been it's been tough it's been tough but um mimsy thank you so much for the five gifted thank you thank you good morning jenly and thank you for the hundred biddies thank you so much mimsy yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i um uh, it's not necessarily a rush right now because it'll be end of year basically when i have to move so um right now it's not too too big a deal but it's definitely something that i'm like saving up for and um you know just keeping in the back of my head you know hi stan good morning good morning um it's about the same to rent and own we just want to sell our home and rent for a while because we might be moving out of the state within the next few years really where do you have any idea where you'll be moving my k um just out of curiosity are you gonna move in with me or what <laughs> am i coming off too strong <laughs> hi crimson good morning good morning hi lani hello hello i'm glad you're already preparing for your big move to north carolina that's exciting <laughs> Oh, oh my goodness <clears throat> hi crown good morning good morning i know we're gonna have a little stream house me and Kay. it'll be lovely it'll be lovely <clears throat> hi boosted good morning good morning all right oh hi rising hello hello we don't know yet but it depends where clayton's job moves him tell me why clayton was like we can move to nc be close to mish girl you should you should i would love that I want some more friends in this area. Um, a lot of the friends that I made like in my adult life were like mostly in like college, you know what I mean? Um, everyone's all over the place though. Oh, I got a cease. Oh God, okay, I'm back. <clears throat> but yeah, I, um, no, I'm not tired. Not at all, actually. I'm, I'm happy to be here. Um, but yeah, I just like, for me, a lot of the people that I, you know, met in my adult life and stuff, they just live everywhere but here. So um, it's kind of tough, you know, I don't really have a ton of friends that live in this area. But um, yeah, that would be cool. That would be really cool. Buenos dias, buenos dias, Kiwi. Como estas? Yo bien, y tu? I'm also planning on moving apartments when my lease ends in July. Yeah, it's so expensive. It's so expensive oh oh cool you're in, in north carolina too that's awesome that's really awesome i'm doing good ash hello hello <clears throat> yeah no for sure um I, I don't know like i guess when you go to college and stuff too especially if you don't go to college in like your hometown or whatever um a lot of the people that you meet are people that are coming from like all over the place you know so um <clears throat> a lot of the friends that you're gonna end up making are people that are gonna move away you know I'm originally from North Carolina. That's where all my extended family is. Oh, really? Girl, well, when are you moving too? <laughs> and I've been trying to get all of you guys to move. I'm like, oh, you guys moving over here? <laughs> uh, I'm like, oh, really, Caitlin? Okay, that sounds cool. When you moving? <laughs> uh, 
Oh my goodness, I can't. All right, Pickles, I got you with the eye tracker uh, when I start my game, okay? But uh, yeah, it's just it's one of those things, you know, where you kind of have to get used to people moving all over the place. <clears throat> I don't want to type anymore. Um, why don't I want to type anymore when my subscription expired? I'm so embarrassed. Sorry, my finances got... Girl, cat stick, you better stop. The amount of people that tell me this... Where they're like, oh my God, I don't have a badge anymore. Mish is going to judge me or Mish is not going to notice me anymore or whatever. Y'all better stop. Do not ever, do not ever feel any sort of way for not being able to continue your sub. Listen, like literally we're having a conversation about the housing stuff. Um, It's literally... It's literally one of those things where it's like, dude, everything is so expensive right now. I'm not expecting you guys to be able to afford subscribing, you know, and there's a lot of free ways to support the channel. Um, you being here is supporting the channel. You liking my videos, you commenting, all of that stuff supports the channel. Whether or not you think you're you're playing a part in supporting my stream, you absolutely are. Um, so do not feel any type of way for not being able to sub. Hi, Kim. Hi, Tiago. Hi, Jonathan. Oh, no way. Well, welcome in. Welcome in. We do have a lot of friends from the UK. Good morning. Good morning. <clears throat> Moon babes, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you. Hi, Sopita. If anyone ever makes you feel any type of way um, for not being able to sub, um, they're probably not worth uh, your support anyway. You know what I mean? Uh, Cortex, thank you so much for the gifted. Soapy, thank you for gifting a, a sub to Catstick. Thank you. And Moon babes, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you. Thank you. I get the feeling though. I understand it. Um, it definitely, I get it. I get it. Trust me. It's just one of those things where, um, I never want you guys to feel uncomfortable for not being able to sub. Um, like I said, even just you guys being here and like, listen, it's like yesterday, right? We got the opportunity to elf literally invited us to go to their stream um so that we could offer giveaways to you guys yesterday that's not possible without you guys sitting here in my stream all the time and spending time with me you know what i mean so like you're still supporting and like just sitting in my stream and adding a viewer to the stream gives me opportunities and it's still like a way of supporting it's just indirectly you know what i mean and that is like really really awesome and i am super grateful for that so don't ever feel any sort of way oh hi dg good morning matt thank you so much for gifting a sub thank you thank you even if you don't subscribe and just watch it's supporting that's good i didn't even know that yes yes so like think about it this way um like yesterday we got invited by elf which is a makeup it's a cosmetics brand um they also have skincare but um those opportunities are typically given to people with like you know more viewers the better obviously because they want as many people involved as possible and like you guys are adding to the amount of people that are here so just being here is is insane you know um even inviting people to watch my stream things like that it really does help sleepy thank you so much for the five gifted thank you thank you thank you elf yes elf elf the cosmetics brand um which i think is really cool they recognize that dead by daylight is a you know is a very diverse community so i really 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 like that i was really um excited to participate for that um and the fact that you guys were able to participate in giveaways i think is really exciting as well but hi brissa oh pf thank you so much for the gifted thank you thank you Aww. <laughs> Win. i appreciate you thank you thank you it was such a fun stream. yeah 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 i i love talking about makeup and everything with you guys it was so much fun um so yeah, it's just really awesome that we get to participate in stuff like that because of you guys, you know, because you guys, they see the community that we have and they see how involved you guys are. And um, I am so, so grateful for things like that. So I really appreciate you guys being here. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, 
yeah, super amazing. I generally feel like you're bestie, even though sometimes I don't see my comments. Erica, I try so hard, but I want you to know that you're one of the people that I absolutely recognize from my um, TikTok. Nico, you know, Ash, you, like there's a bunch of a bunch of you guys that are um, on my TikTok all the time. And I, I absolutely recognize you, especially because on TikTok, I get to see your profile pictures. And I feel like it kind of helps me because you guys don't have colors like on Twitch. Twitch people have colors and I associate colors with them, but you guys actually have profile pictures and stuff. So I remember you guys um, based on that stuff. The treats and oh, I know. <laughs> Hi, Melody. Good morning. Girl, I still have not done The Walking Dead. Hi, Gabs. Oh, my God. Yesterday, I got on um, Fortnite. Girl, I was overwhelmed. There were so many friend requests from you guys. Um, we were able to play with Gabs yesterday. Gabs uh, sent me a little message on there. I was like, oh, can we, can I play? You know, and I was like, oh, yes. Um, so I'm always excited when, when I get little messages from you guys. Again, if you... You know, as I don't always have spots, but I am always happy to have you guys um, join me on Fortnite. I love playing with you guys. So, yeah, I love hanging out with you guys, cutie. Mm -mm -mm. She noticed my video from yesterday. I did. I did. I'm just a color to you. Stop, pancakes. <laughs> You're one of the people I've known for like the longest on here. Uh, I saw you were playing Floor is Lava. No, I didn't play. Um, I got off right before they started playing that. Um, but <laughs> I did get to watch them play it. And I, that, that was so funny. I didn't even know what that was until yesterday. Um, hi, Kenny. Good morning. Good morning. Got here from TikTok. Love your clips. Welcome in. Welcome in. Uh, my Fortnite username is not Mish. Um, and yeah, like I said, I'm not like usually I'll have like one or two people with me sometimes. And we usually always have a spot for squads. So like, you know, if you guys ever want to play on there, just send me a message. Um, if I if I don't respond, it's maybe because we don't have a spot. But <gasps> I didn't know you were awake. I'm not going to lie. I thought you overslept. Guys, it's M's duo day. <laughs> It's M's duo day. Remember he won the duo day the other day? Yes! It's M's duo day. Girl, I thought you overslept. I was like, man, I haven't seen M talk in chat. Maybe he overslept. <laughs> oh, that's so exciting. Aw, thank you, Ash. Thank you. Hi, Geraldine. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, yeah. Um, let's see what the percentage is at today. Today it is at... Okay, so we're at 200? Yeah, we're at 200 already. Wow. Okay. So we'll be at 300 probably pretty soon. Cool. That's awesome. Um, no, 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 no. Em. It's because my thing took forever to upload. Um, let me see if I ever uploaded. They updated it? Wait. What What did they update? The game? Am I recording? Not yet. How does duo days work? I usually give them away in chat. Hi, Shivato. Good morning. They're twinning. We are twinning. We are. They doubled the PP. They updated the community bonuses. Oh, really? They upped the percentages. Oh, damn. Wait, so it's going to go higher? Oh, oh, you're right. It's going to go all the way to 400. My two favorite streams. Oh, my Today's God. I didn't even realize the first time that I looked. It's gonna go all the way to 400. Per Girl, I'm gonna have to spend blood points like every two seconds. Are you kidding me? That's insane. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, let me make sure my video posted. Okay, I did, cool. <clears throat> Is the chat bugged in your stream? No, 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 no. Um, Everything should be good. Okay, I am gonna start recording. I'm recording now. Thank you, chat. Love you guys for reminding me. Um, I think everything is good now. Hi, Sultan. Good morning. Good morning. <clears throat> My girlfriend doesn't game, but she started paying attention to your streams. <gasps> oh, dude, that's so cute. And asked me to play DVD. Oh, that's so awesome, Sleepy. I love that. That's so awesome. Yeah, 400% is crazy, Eric. I think that's insane. Hi, Lexus. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, I appreciate you guys so much. I hope you guys know uh, how grateful I am um, for all the support. It means a lot to me, seriously. Oh, sometimes I, I like, I don't know. I, th I think about just like how 
far everything has come as far as like my stream my community i feel so freaking grateful dude uh to have you guys and to be able to come on here every day and and hang out with you guys and oh i just love you guys i hope you guys know how grateful i am for for you guys spending your days with me it means a lot to me it means a lot to me hi smooth good morning <sighs> I was literally crying happy tears. Oh, stop, jellyfish, stop. It just means a lot to me that you guys get so excited for stuff that I'm like doing with you guys. And oh, I can't wait to um, to be able to share more moments like that with you guys. It means a lot. Were you yawning or fighting back tears? <laughs> Shut up. Oh, you said you weren't getting mushy. You're right, you're right. <clears throat> Hold on. <laughs> Okay, is the stream blurry? Ah, is the stream is the stream blurry? Chat, is anyone else having issues? Yeah, I'm just feeling mushy today. Sorry, girl. Sorry, sorry. It's fine. Okay, okay, good. And the quality is in 1080, right? Now understand why I'm dead. Most games killers are grinding. I think. <laughs> yeah, I think so. They're trying to get their blood points. Oh my goodness. Save the machinist for Friday. I know. Friday is the drunk stream. I'm super excited about it. Hi, Space. Good morning. The stream is clear. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Awesome. What moment? What did I miss? Well, just like any stream moments, honestly. I always like, I feel like I come in and we have like all sorts of fun together all the time. I just appreciate it, you know? That's all. That's all. He's aiming his little thing at me. Oh my God. He waited for so damn long, sir. That man was waiting for 10 years. Oh, I knew he was going to try and do that. You went all in in the prediction. What's the prediction? Be honest. I can't dodge that. That was good. Yeah. This guy seems very patient with his bubbles. I don't even know how to dodge like that. Is the stream on Friday? Um, long one or is it just an even? Okay, no, it's not going to be a one long stream. So Friday's stream is going to be a little strange. Um, if you guys missed the announcement, I'm going to be doing a, um, a drunk stream on Friday. I mark your calendars because i don't do this hi davindra good morning i do it once a year um every year i do uh one special stream where we can unlock like goals for that year um and one of the goals that we unlock is a drunk stream and we did unlock it this year um so I am going to do a drunk stream on Friday night. Um, I'll still go live at my normal time. Of course, Savindra, of course. Hi, Rachie. Oh, you changed your name. I like Rachie. Rachie's cute. I like it. Um, but yeah, it'll be around 8 p.m. Eastern that I'll go live at nighttime. Um, and I'll stream at my normal time, but just probably a short stream. So I'll probably go live at 11 and maybe stream for like three hours or something. Um, and then go from there. And we'll come back, uh, at nighttime. It's your rest day too. Nice. Nice. Hi, Diana. Good morning. Please don't teleport. Please don't teleport. Please don't teleport. Okay, cool. <laughs> All right. Chat. I gotta let my doggy out apparently. Cause she's, she's being a baby. Hi, Phoenix. I think you should make it a hammered stream. I, I don't think that would be great. <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea. You'd think for a drunk stream, I should be drinking for the duration, but she's really going to have a beer and a half and get wasted. Okay. <laughs> oh, for my people that have been here for previous drunk streams. Um, yeah, it's a little... It's a little... I'm, I'm a lightweight, okay? I'm very lightweight, so it's just... I just don't drink, okay? I never drink. So when I drink, it's just so easy for me to get tipsy. <laughs> Last time I did a drunk open lobbies. She was so silly during our lobby. Oh my God, Sinister. I love that so many of you guys um, remember our drunk open lobby days. Damn, dude, he's so patient. I feel like I did. Uh, it's so hard to dodge this guy. He's just so patient. 
Just drink a lot of water too? Of course, of course. <laughs> Anubis, that's funny. Hi, Siren. Good morning. Hi, Flood. You don't work on Friday? Let's go. Let's go. You have a barbecue that night? Well, maybe you could come by after or something. I don't know. No, Lucy, I think I'm going to be drinking mimosas this time. I know it's like really nighttime mimosas. So what? Okay, what about it? <laughs> Hi, Diana. Good morning. Good morning. <clears throat> I think I've only been around for one. Oh, really? Um, I don't, maybe we can look at some stuff from it. But um, yeah, it's it's fun. I just I do open lobbies during it, so it'll be open lobby day, um, where you guys can join up. And last couple of drunk streams that we've done because i've been streaming for a couple years now so i've done like what two or three um but chat gets involved they be drinking they be partaking in activities you know um and you guys join my open lobbies a little tipsy y'all be chatting a little tipsy and it's so freaking funny um i really have the best time with you guys uh during those streams and even if you're not drinking just like i feel like a lot of you guys match the energy and i love it i love it I don't drink. Yeah, 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 yeah. Literally, a lot of people were not necessarily drinking, but just, like, matching the energy, you know, which we love. What if we take a shot every time you escape? Girl, you guys can take a shot. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. No, I didn't activate it, actually. I'll activate it after this game since I forgot for this match. You're right. I do have to do my uh, eye tracker, so I will absolutely activate it. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, maybe I can take a shot of water while you guys take a shot. <laughs> oh my God, Erica. How about how about this? If y'all are drinking with me, y'all gotta take a shot anytime I say be honest. How's that? <laughs> y'all gotta take a shot anytime I say be honest. Anytime I'm like respect. Anytime I'm like, you know, uh, we're gonna be drunk so quick. <laughs> You guys are going to be drunk so quick. <laughs> oh, so you're trying to kill us? <laughs> oh, my God. I can't. I hate how people glorify drinking. Like, good for you. You're an alcoholic. Are you saying I glorify drinking? My, oh, yeah. I'm definitely an alcoholic considering I drink once a year. You're right. You're right. <laughs> Definitely, definitely. My liver could not take that. Same, 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 girl. That's what I'm saying. I am definitely not going to partake in that. I know for a fact I would definitely be gone. Um, not at all. Oh, okay, okay. You're talking about just in general. Got it. I was about to say, girl, I don't even drink. <laughs> I'm like, I don't even drink. I'm going to drink it like literally I drink once a year for you guys, and that's it. It's funny because I always save the VOD um, and we upload it on uh, on YouTube. So I'll upload it on YouTube Hello, uh, so you guys can, can watch it if you miss it. But the VOD on Twitch will not be saved, just as a heads up. Um, the reason being, it's the <sighs> one time Loser. that I stream and I listen to copyright music. Um, <laughs> so there will be no Twitch VOD. It will be all on YouTube later on. Um, but there's not gonna be any sort of like Twitch bot or anything where you guys can watch it later. He's good. He is good. Hi, Awi. Good morning. Good morning. It's usually the young people teleporting guys randomly placed. Um, oh, are the spawns for his little teleporting guys randomly placed? No, so the way his power works is the more he uses his power, it like builds up until it just randomly drops the little body. Is she reading Twitch chat? I'm reading all my chats, yes. But mostly, Twitch chat is probably the most active, Sam. Hi, Shay. Never forget the Bad Romance Legion match. <laughs> oh, girl. Poor me and M. He was good, right, M? I feel like he was good. Um, let me show you guys. You said there won't be a VOD. Sorry, I zoned out. Yeah, there won't be a VOD on Twitch. It'll just be on YouTube later on. And it'll be un, um, unlisted. So it'll just be link only. Hold on. Let me show you guys this match. It's so freaking funny. Um, this is from a, a match a long time ago. Hold on. Let me see if I can find it. Gotta go to my videos. 
Good morning, Bryce. Good morning. Do you get bad hangovers? Um, I don't really drink super often, so I do feel like I get a little. Um, I, I just if I feel awful the next day. I'm not really a big fan of drinking for that reason. Okay, hold on. Let me see if I if I got it. Is this the one? Maybe that's not the one. Hold on. Hold on, chat. Trying to find this one match. Um. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Is this the one? Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, okay, this is a good one. Okay, this is from two years ago, okay? <laughs> this is from two years ago. So this is a long time ago. Um, but this was during uh, one of my drunk streams. And this was so freaking funny. Here we go. I'll show you guys. Let me make it smaller. This match was so freaking funny to us. Like, we never, ever, ever forget this match. Watch this. So Girl, I sound so you sloppy. Thought, imagine, imagine. Where you at, Legion? Come back. <laughs> Come back, Legion. Ooh. Oh my god, Legion. Please. <laughs> Hello. Oh, you thought. Oh, sing again. You won't, you won't. Sing again. <laughs> I was so. Please, you, you can you want tell want I've been drinking. Yeah. <laughs> Me getting stuck. Oh my god. god. I'm looping, I'm looping. Oh my god. Oh my god, I have any blocker. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. I might have to waste the pallet, chat. Hey, I'll miss, be honest. This is only an hour into stream, well, by the way. We walk, we walk. Oh my god, I'm looping. Big fun, got a blast. <laughs> Literally an hour into he's stream. In he's in his power. Can we spin him in his power? Be honest. Wait, wait. Oh my goodness, my legion! Imagine! <laughs> Imagine how embarrassing. <laughs> okay, okay. So hold on. So that legion, that man, was um. <laughs> Later in the match, he just stands still for a minute. And he just stops moving, okay? Because we spun him so many times, okay? We spun him so many times, he just stops moving altogether. And then he comes into my stream after the game, and he's like, hey, sorry I stopped moving for a bit. Um, I, I threw my controller and the batteries fell out. I, I was just so pissed off. <laughs> and I was like, I was like, oh, I was like, oh, I'm sorry if uh, if I spun you. I'm just like really drunk right now. <laughs> like, why would that make him feel better? Why did I say that? Hi, Dirt Chief. Good morning. Good morning. A bro came in and told us he threw his remote, bro, his controller, and, and the batteries fell out. And that's what I said to him. I said, oh, sorry. I'm just drunk. <laughs> like, no, girl. That's not going to make him feel any better, okay? Absolutely not. That would literally make me feel worse. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. It was so funny. I will we'll never forget that one because that poor man got spun so many times that match. Not even just by me. Like, literally, the, the people in my lobby were cracked, too. Everyone was freaking running circles around this man. We felt so bad. We felt so, so bad. <laughs> so you're a silly drunk? I, I tend to be a happy drunk, yeah. I, um, I tend to be really, really happy drunk. The controller caught astray. I know. I know. I feel bad. This poor man. He has barbecue, so he's probably going to come this way. Yeah, there he is. That's hilarious, dude. I I tend to be quite happy and very, like, um, 
I compliment a lot. So, you know, that's that's just that's just how I get. It's basically me normally, but like way more excited and just like way more cocky as well. <laughs> I'm like, oh my god, I'm so good. I spun him so hard. <laughs> a lot of I love yous. Yep, yep. That's right, my John. <laughs> Your laugh was next level. Yeah. It's so funny looking back on, on those games. Mm -mm -mm. Let's go back this way, I guess. Hi, Pug. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. I tell everyone I love them too when I'm drunk. Yeah. I just get happy. I'm the same as I am normally, just like way happier and like more, more bold. So I'll probably be like, oh my God, I love you so much. You know, like I'll probably be extra mushy. <laughs> Stop, family. Oh, that's so funny. We can play cards on this sort of. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can play cards. Is it letting you, Sultan, or is it having issues? Let me know. Confidence through the roof. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yep. 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 I feel like he threw his controller again after Miss said that. <laughs> we have those VODs saved if you guys want to ever watch them. Um, I think it's like exclamation mark drunk stream or something. Crawl to the pallet. Crawl to the pallet. Him. I will save you. Nice. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> when, okay. <laughs> I was thinking, you know, you could call it bad. We'd be good, but you know, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Not mushy mish. Oh, for sure. Are you ever doing a face reveal? I've already streamed with Cam so many times, girl. I, I, no matter how many times I stream with Cam, people always ask for a face reveal. What time are we streaming till? 7 p.m. Um, today? Or do you mean when do I start my stream on Friday? My, my stream on Friday will start at like 8, I think. That's probably what I'm going to aim for. Because usually they only last like three hours or so when I do drunk stream. So, um, yeah, I'm thinking 8 is probably the best shot. Let's go over here. This man's got all the mind games, huh? Interesting. Bro has all the mind games. Mishi is Batman. This is real and true. Real and true. I am indeed Batman. How could I possibly show my identity? Then the people of Gotham, Good morning, the Mr. the Chef. villains of Gotham, will come for me. Absolutely not. APM EST, yes. He knows I have entity blocker, so he doubled back. Very smart. Very smart, very smart. Yeah. This Wraith loves mind games? He does, yeah. Hi, Queen. Good morning. Good morning, good morning. Because I'm a superhero. What do you mean? Because I'm Batman, rubber ducks. <laughs> Uh, Mochi, thank you so much for the nine months. Mimsy, thank you for the hundred biddies. Supernova for the seven months. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Um, but back to what Lady said. Lady said, I'm not sure if you mentioned before, but are you selling any merch like T-shirts, etc.? Would love some Mishy merch. Well, it's a good thing you asked, because I may or may not have something to share with you guys. I don't know. Should I share that with you guys right now? Is it about that time? <laughs> Is it about that time? Hmm. We are going to be doing plushies for merch. So I have a little elephant that I always have on my keychain there. And I thought it was very appropriate to do an elephant because uh, I love elephants around me honestly i have a little elephant blanket that i uh sit with every day when i stream right now i'm literally using the blanket 
that I'm talking about. It's a, a gray elephant blanket. It has little elephants all over it. I have a little elephant charm that you guys see on my Nia. Never take it off. Um, and yeah, I mean, I shared a picture yesterday of Kara with her little elephant. Like, we got little elephants everywhere. So... We're going to do a little plushie, and it's an elephant, and I got the artwork last night for it. Do you guys want to see it? Be honest, be honest. It'll still be a little while before it goes into production, but I want to show you guys the artwork. <laughs> I want to show you guys the artwork. There's going to be a couple adjustments made, um... Just like to try and put it in plushy form, you know what I mean? Um, but I would love to show you guys the artwork since you guys have been uh, super supportive throughout the process and stuff. We've talked about it quite a bit. So I definitely want to keep you guys engaged with like everything that's going on and let you guys know where we're at in the process. But I think it's really exciting. I'm super excited about it. I thought it was going to be a bunny fun. A bunny fun mint. Girl, what about me? Screams Bunny Fung Min. <laughs> Hi, Yuffie. Good morning. Good morning. It picked up your old match and then just transitioned to the new one. We could play cards on the... Wait, what? Hold on. Is my thing... Wait, so is nice being buggy right now for you guys near? And... Let me know. Let me know. I thought it was going to be a twins plush. Not a twins plush. Now I know y'all messing with me. Y'all being mean now. <laughs> y'all being mean. Hey, sexy. Wow, that is a... That is a bold first message. Bold first message. I don't know. We're not really there yet, buddy. <laughs> a little bold. A little bold. Um, hi, Nia. Will you heal me? I thought it was going to be a K. Y'all better stop. Y'all better stop. Hi, Sabrina. Are you live only on TikTok? Not today, no. I came out of a match and I was school merchant and somebody called me Nia with a mask and mask and claws. Really? I find, I don't know. I, I feel like Nia gets so much hate. Um, not as much as she used to. I feel like a lot of people used to give her so much hate. But I don't see the comparison with school merchant. Like, that's a... That's a bit aggressive. That is very aggressive. I didn't want him to get zoned. Buy him a little bit of time, even if it's just a, a hit. Mm -mm -mm. Good morning, purple. Good morning. Do you teabag killers when you're drunk? I don't think so. Not that I can remember. Hi, Max. Good morning. Hi, Wolf. Hello, hello. It's nice to see everybody. I'm assuming Mish can't make licensed DVD material as merch for everyone asking for DVD plushies. Yeah, no, yeah. It's definitely, like, my take on, like, an, an elephant, you know? Um, but we did take some inspiration from Mr. Puddles there, so, yeah. How big is this stuffy going to be? Um, I can't tell you, like, exact dimensions, but it's going to be, like, a pretty solid size. Like, it's not going to be, like, a little three-inch plushie. Like, it's pretty solid. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Not that rubber dogs. Let's go over here. Damn, he actually hit that. Hold on, him. Damn, he picked you up. All right, that's fine. That's not fine, actually. <laughs> I was going to run past and go for the slug, but he's still... Well, he went for the pickup. That's good. Let's heal. Will there be different colors of the plush? No, no. Um, remember, these are custom plushies. So these are specifically created for me. Um, they're not like, it's not like I just like went out and bought a cute elephant plush or anything like that. Like they're specifically created. I worked with an artist to create a design for this, um, so that we could have a custom plushie that only we will have, you know? 
Mm -mm -mm. I'm also an artist who makes stuff like that. I'd like to see the process of dealing with. Yeah, 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 yeah. So right now we're we're still like I said. I I worked with an artist. She just finished up making the design for us, um, and then we're gonna go into talks with the plushie company, and the plushie company will have their team kind of see what we can do as as far as like bringing it to uh, fruition in plushie form. Um. So there might be some changes between now and then. Can you show me the elephant charm? Yeah, I'll show you guys the elephant charm and then I'll show you guys the design. How's that? We're, we are doing with him. We are. Mm -mm -mm. You got this girl. You got this. I love your outfit, M. It's so good. Good try. We'll prick us on the left. Object of obsession. Object of obsession. Good morning, Manda. Good morning. Ah, oh, welcome in. Welcome in. It's fine for you? Okay, good. Good, good, good. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. I'm glad you guys enjoy the cards. It's awesome. I love it. I love it. I'm going to college for photography and multimedia. I'm really into that kind of stuff. I'm making arts. Oh, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I'm super excited to share with you guys here. Let's check it out. All right. Let me pull it up for you guys. I need to respond to her as well so she can send us the the design. All right. So, and again, there's going to be some changes between now and when it gets made, of course. Um, but I want to show you guys. All righty. So, I want it to say, like love mish in some sort of way you know what i mean um so i did put on there um my signature and i want it to be like special um oh is that my phone oh shoot okay sorry about that um but yeah we're gonna we're gonna show you guys the uh mr puddles charm and then we can show you guys those so no, no tengo um, uso como un, un filter en OBS, que es el programa que uso para, um, para hacer mi stream. Pero nada en mi pantalla personal. Eso es solamente para el stream. Okay, so here is the Mr. Puddles, right? So Mr. Puddles looks like this. If you notice, he's got little white feet. He's got little red bow. He has, um, he's pink, right? Um, so... Taking inspo from Mr. Puddles, we are going to have a little elephant made. And this is what our little elephant looks like. Are you ready? Are you ready? Ta-da! <laughs> so he'll be pink, just like just like Mr. Puddles. He'll be pink and he'll have a little red bow, just like that. And then he'll have a little um, heart blush and um his little eyes will probably move his little eyes a little closer to the like his little trunk um but then his little foot will say love mish on it um because i i want it to say something for you guys um so it's like it's coming from me obviously um and that's what he'll look like overall and i can show you guys um some examples of like some of the plushies that they've made so you can kind of get an idea of what it would be like in plushie form so give me a second let me let me show you guys real quick so cute thank you thank you i'm glad you guys like it it's so cute it's gonna be so cute yes it'll be pre-orders um the company that is making it will uh basically put it on i'll let you guys know when it's available um so think of the plushie that I just showed you guys, right? Think of that. Um, and this is like a plushie from that company, okay? Just to show you guys kind of what we mean when I say like the little blush, right? So think of that, but like you see how this little blush is like like a little patch kind of? Something like that. That's a, This is an actual plushie from the company that's making ours um so think of the elephant i know it's it's a drawing right now but it's gonna turn into something similar to this you know um where it's like a really soft plushy and again the little blush and the little eyes um that looks so soft yeah 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 um 
I, I am super excited to be uh, working on those for you guys. Um, that was something that we unlocked a while ago as well. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be awesome. Um, and then for the people asking about the size, um, I think it depends. I think it depends. That's something that like they're gonna basically look at the design of um, our plushie and then just like they have to send me a sample and stuff. Um, and then we'll kind of just decide on there like as far as like the actual size that we'll end up making it but um yeah i hope you guys are excited about it i know i am i'm super super excited it's so cute good i'm glad that you guys like it that makes me so happy that makes me so so happy yeah we are currently on 200 percent. so yeah that plush is adorable. I'm glad this is happening. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm glad that you guys like it. Oh, that's awesome, Kim. That's really cute. Hi, Tier. That's so cool because that's basically what I want to do in my future after college. Really? Oh, cool. Yeah, I've been trying to involve you guys in the process because I think it's like such a cool thing to be a part of, you know? Um, how much will it be? It will be a, a $29.99 uh, dollar plush. Um and and you guys will be able to see the details of the plushie on their website and everything so um yeah the, i want the quality to be good so i'll be i'll be working on like you know what fabrics we use and all that stuff um so just to give you guys an idea of what's coming you know i want you guys to to be excited about it like me um most of their plushies from what i've seen seem to be like around seven eight inches which i think is pretty solid um i think that's like a good size not too big not too little you know because i feel like if it was like a three inch plushie because i have like a little i don't know like a little little plushie on my desk that's a little spider-man but he's like he's little he's like a four inch or something um so i want him a little bit bigger than that for sure um i'm new what's going on oh nothing we're just chatting we're talking about uh a plushie that we're making for chat hi pablo good morning good morning all right is it gonna be available internationally as far as i know yes this is one of the best dvd events ever i can't believe they increased it to 400 percent chat they've never ever ever i've been playing this game for a very long time they have never, in all the time that I've been playing, um, given us a 400% blood point increase from what I remember. I don't know if maybe I missed it at some point, but I don't remember us ever getting that much of an increase. 400% is crazy. It is. It is. The red perk. Um, so that's not actually a perk. That is a add-on. Um, it's his paintbrush add-on. And what that does is it... Uh, spawns us in asleep so that's why all of us are asleep right now unless someone has woken up from a clock which danger tits has <laughs> not that their name i can't come for me come for me yeah 400 percent without any offerings is insane any opinions on the event i think it's a bit underwhelming really um how so i was just saying it was a good event i mean we're getting 400 percent blood points i feel like that's insane You think he'll go for it? Ooh, he did go for it. Good fake, good fake. Nice, she can get away now. I still don't get what Freddy's skills does. Okay, so when you're asleep against Freddy, you're affected by his abilities. And his main ability is placing blood pools, right? Um, what blood pools do is they hinder you so they'll make you slower than normal um so instead of moving at a hundred percent movement speed you'll move quite a bit slower but he has a special add-on which you've probably seen before it's quite popular um he has a special add-on that makes him instead of getting fake i mean blood pools he'll have fake pallets so you'll see pallets where there's none he could have swung there and killed me. I just want to make that clear. <laughs> Jane almost got me killed there, but that's all right. 
So usually if you see a Freddy with blood pools, you usually want to avoid the blood pools as much as possible because they will slow you down. Just to make that clear. Hi, Jill. Good morning. All right, we're on a pallet now. Oh, CJ took? CJ took, CJ took. You got this, Em. I believe. Oh. I love your streams and you're so nice. You never get mad. Oh, thank you. Thank you, cheese. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. What are your thoughts on degree shaming? Degree shaming? What do you mean by that? One of the best. Yeah, it is. It's going to be 400 long. So right now it's 200, but they increased it to morning, a maximum Mitch. of 400 so instead of 200. You. You have Aww. Such a great DVD community. Thank you, Asad. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome to my YouTube. Um, Doc, thank you so much for the six months. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you so very much. Thank you. Thank you. DVD tweeted that they're going to be making an announcement about compensation for the offering being um, broken. See, I told you guys. It's a good thing. I am recording. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Schmoes. Yeah, me and M are dueling. It's it's M's duo day. He told me like, you know, I told him, I mean, I have a free day if you want. And uh, and he was like, yeah, okay. And I was like, okay. I don't know. I don't know who's like gonna make it. I'm excited. I'm excited. <laughs> Hi, Veneer. Palisades are tricky. They are when they're on the edge, like that one was for sure, definitely. All right, let's go for the save. Actually, let me do a little pit stop real quick. Em, hang in there. Hang in there, bud. Thank you for the gifts on TikTok. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Em. Nice. All right. Now we have a medi. See, I got a medi now. Oh, yeah. And then his secondary ability, just so, you know, since we're talking Freddy abilities, um, his secondary ability is being able to teleport to generators. So you'll notice that he can teleport around the map um, through your generator. But remember that he can cancel that ability. So if you see the little blood start to happen around the generator and then it goes away, it's just because he's spamming his ability at the gen just to get you off of it, like to scare you that he's going to teleport. But he's not actually teleporting. I know, that's why I said that, Ellie. <laughs> I'm glad someone caught it. Uh, M solo has been rough. Girl, some days it would be like that, for real. Some days solo queue be tough. I asked him yesterday when you two were going to do it, and he said, I don't know. Yeah, we didn't know. We didn't know aviation. We were um, playing Fortnite last night, and we decided today, so, because I had a free day, so, yeah. I was like, oh, chat's going to be excited about that. Where is he? No, don't go for them. That's mean. Danger tits, take a hit. Okay, there she is. <laughs> there she is. She took a hit. Good, good. Okay, let's heal this girl. And there's an add-on that makes the blood spray out of all the gens, regardless of which one he teleports to. Yes, true. It basically causes the blood to happen everywhere anytime he uses his power. See that blood pool right there? That blood pool is what slows you down. You want to avoid those in chase, if possible. Watch, when I run through it, see uh, the hindered marker? But it's a good thing to run through them when you're not in chase because it gets rid of the blood pool. So that blood pool will be gone. Um, The new mode? What new mode? I don't know what new mode. I'll be watching the playbacks since I'm in class. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good, Aviation. Does, does playing DVD give you an advantage of playing Fortnite? Oh! I don't think so. Um, yeah, I don't know if there's any... I think just gaming in general. I mean, there's some similarities, like movement and stuff, but not too, too much. Congrats on 90k. Dude, isn't that crazy? Oh my god. No freaking way. Did we hit it? Stop. That's insane. Hi, STF. Good morning. Good morning. All right, let's go for the save. Hi, chat. Hi, Mish. Love your TikToks. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Welcome in. Thank you. Hi, TMI. Good morning. Good morning. 
All right, let's just do the generator. M's not on death hook, and um, me and Sable can still afford a hook stay. So we'll let them loop for a little while while we do a generator. My favorite killer to play against. Um, my favorite killer is Chucky. My top five favorite killers are Billy Oni Myers, Bubba, and Artist. Hi, Gab. Good morning. Good morning. Hi, Bussies. Hello, hello. Aw, thank you, Tyler. Thank you, thank you. Artist? Yes, I love Artist. Artist is my favorite design-wise. Absolutely love her design. See how he kind of... Like, I kind of waited to see if he committed to the tall port. Um, specifically for that reason. He doesn't know that I saw him as well. Because he had nowhere to hide. And he's used to survivors not knowing. But I have object, and object shows me his aura anytime he sees my aura. So we knew what he had there. Tips for getting better at looping. Highly recommend practicing your camera control. Camera control is really important. Being able to look behind you while you're in chase is super, super important. Surprise, he didn't come back to stop this gen. This gen is super close. Okay. And then we should be able to... Jane will finish her gen before anything. Okay, adrenaline maybe? No adren, but she has a pallet. Mm, okay, the doors are across the map. So I'm going to try and assist her to making it to the other side of the map. I don't think she makes it. No, nope. sadly. Okay, that's fine. Basement is here, which isn't ideal. But if I body block it, maybe he'll go around. Perfect, okay. Right there, we at least avoided him going basement, which is huge. If we get an in-game basement situation, that's going to be really bad for us, so. I feel so off if I don't have Bond. Yeah, yeah. Bond is my favorite perk as well. Freaking love Bond. Okay, we'll go over here now. He's going to go back. Okay. What does Bond do? Bond shows you the aura of your teammates when they're within 36 meters of you. Me too, Shay. Never take it off, ever. All right, we're going to go ahead and unhook her because obviously he's not nearby. We don't have a lullaby or anything. <clears throat> Hi, Ezra. Good morning. But, Doc, thank you so much for the six months again. And telepathy, thank you so much for the six months as well. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I really, really appreciate it. She is one tap him. If, uh, if he gets on me, then maybe you can help her out. But she's literally one tap. Oh, nice. She had life. All right. If we can just get to this side of the map, that's huge. Good job, team. Good job. Freaking love this. Okay. Me and M still have a hook state, so we can afford... I honestly think he makes it. Uh, yeah, I think he makes it. Let's get the door. If they're there at the door, he makes it. If they're not, he might not. <gasps> she took a hit for him. Nice. They finished her heal that was 99 and she took a hit. Hi, Lime. Good morning. Good morning. Hi, NECA. Hi, Lime. Hi, Kim. Good job, team. That was awesome. Very nice. Very nice. We love the teamwork on that. Uh, see, this is his little red paintbrush. Um, and like I said, it makes you start the trial in the dream world. Yeah, that was great. That was awesome. Oh, thank you, Aviation. We appreciate that. That was really close, huh? That was a good game, though. Very good game. Can you use Dramaturgy? I'm not a huge fan of Dramaturgy. Um, It just it doesn't really fit me, I feel like. I'm not used to running it. So satisfying. Solo queue could never. Two of those teammates that were taking hits were solo queue. Those are solo queue teammates. Good morning, Rusty. Good morning. Mm. 
Hi, Freckles. I'm stretching. <laughs> oh. Did you know it says in your FAQ Windows is your favorite is one of your favorite perks? It is. Yeah, it's it's one of my favorite perks. I was just talking about that yesterday, actually. Um, that's because it is a little big stretch. Yes, 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 yes. I love solo queue too. I love when situations like that happen, honestly. Like where, you know, teammates that you don't know come through and, and body block for you and stuff. Oh, I love it. I love it. Um, this build right now is my favorite, but I do run other perks every now and then. Um, I like, like, flashbang. I like, um, what are some of my favorites? Um, uh, what do I like to run? Let the good through. I can't remember off the top of my head. Oh, that would be weird. It'd be, that would be really weird. Is it important to wake up? I usually don't because of timing. I personally don't unless like I run by a clock and it's just there. Like if it's convenient and it's there for me, then I'll do it. But otherwise, no. Can I use resilience? I don't really feel like running resilience right now. I think I'm good with my build, um, but I do like background player. What else do I like? Breakout is really fun. For the people buckle up is really fun. Um, what else? What else? Flashbang is cool. Hope is cool. For the people, like I said, is cool. Um, Medal of Man is really fun. No One Left Behind is cool. Love Plunderers, of course. Good morning, Leah. Good morning. Opinion on us, Fung Mains. Girl. I'm not a fan of Fung Min. I'm not going to lie. I I am kind of a little bit of a Fung Min hater. She's so loud, dude. If I'm doing a generator with a Fung Min, <laughs> she's like this. <laughs> I'm like, girl, you're not even injured. Relax. Relax. She kills me. She's so loud. Constantly. Yes, constantly. She's not even injured and her ass is loud. And when I play killer, I'm not even going to lie. Sometimes I'll go into a tile and I hear breathing and I'm like, oh, Fung Min's in here. <laughs> I just can't. I can't with her. It bothers me. Her outfits are so cute. I know. I feel like that's why most people play her, honestly. Mm -mm -mm. <sighs> All right, let's put this here. Ada's quiet, but her footsteps are loud. Did I hear that? Honestly, I don't mind the footsteps. I'd rather the footsteps be loud than, than the breathing. I hear them in lockers all the time. Yeah, Tori, I'm telling you. And then people are like, how did you know Fung Min is there? I'm like, I don't know. Maybe because she's breathing like, <gasps> you know, like, girl, <laughs> please. Would you consider Talita loud? I don't know. I don't know that I've played Talita enough to to really know. Hi, Cheese. Good morning. But I do I do think Talita is really cute. Working beautifully. Oh, good, 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 good. Near, thank you so much for the sub. Oh, nice. Thank you, thank you, Near. Thank you for the support. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Hi, Wano. I will never admit to that. Ever. Talita's like in the middle? You think so? Girl, that was the biggest lunge I've ever seen in my life. Holy shit. That man was lunging for three business days. Three business days that man was lunging. Okay. Fake. Didn't work. That's all right. Wow. Don't y'all agree? Damn, that was good. That was good. Okay, we'll go over here. Bro, do you have... What the fuck? Am I in the circle? Oh, it's because he has the blood, Chai. He has the giant-ass coup. Holy... Holy coup! He has the blood on him. See that, like, blood trailing up on him? That means he's benefiting from the, the circle. Oh, yeah, we're right inside the circle. Damn, dude, that was crazy. What circle? So the event, you know that red circle? You see that red circle all around there? 
The event gives survivors and killers a boost. Um, so for survivors, it gives you your grunts of pain are 50% quieter and your um, trails of blood go away 50% faster. And then for killer, it gives him like a built-in coup where he has 100% bigger lunge. The way the unknown breaks pallets. I know, I know. It's so funny. The animation is so weird, dude. Ooh, what a hit. Oh, stop it. Not me calling you stinky. <laughs> Please. I can't. All right, I'm just trying to get rid of my bubble hat. Oh, are you in the pallet, though? Nah, you're not. Damn, that was a... That was a hit. The lunch is crazy. It's insane. It is insane. I, I don't even know what to say about that damn lunch. Oh my god. Do not, do not dare. Because you can pair it with Ku, too. And get an even bigger lunge. Nice, we got rid of it. Hello. I saw a TikTok where a guy played Myers and equipped Ku and showed how far the lunge can go. It was insane. Yeah. Myers already has a bigger lunge, and then you throw on Ku, and then, you know, you get in the circle. Like, obviously, it's all gonna stack. Well, it's kind of like I posted a TikTok where I was talking about the event. And I said in the TikTok, your grunts of pain are 50% quieter, right? And then there were so many comments like, it also makes your, your crouching, um, you know, silent. And I'm like, well, girl, that's, yes. <laughs> that goes in with, do you guys know that your base kit crouching is quieter, right? By default, so like, if your base kit crouching is quieter and you have the event that also makes it quieter, then of course your your crouching is gonna be a lot quieter. Damn. Does it work in customs? No, the events are never in customs. That's not specific to the event. That's specific to just like crouching while you're injured. Do you have a video on flashbangs? I do, I do. If you go to my TikTok, it's on there or you can do exclamation mark flashbangs. Um, and I think it's on there as well. Skull Merchant Lunge is insane and artist. No, they're the same as everyone. Um, there's a measure to everyone's lunch. Like there's a specific distance that it covers. It's the same for artists and skull merchant. Um, some of the killers that have a bigger lunch are killers like Nurse or Myers when he's in tier three. I never knew crouching made your groans. Yeah, yeah, it makes your, your sound quieter when you're injured. So if you're ever trying, it comes in specifically handy when you're going against a spirit. Um, if you're going against a spirit, when you're injured, it's really hard to dodge her when she's phasing. So something that you can do sometimes is just like crouch on a loop or something. And that can throw them off because you're quieter than they expect you to be. Mm -mm. I think you're referring to uh, Ku, Shweetal. Ku is, is what increases your lens. Damn, she went down. She's on death hook. I wanted to help her out. No. Also, hi, Eve. Welcome in. I thought the blood pool benefits were global once you activate a pool, or so I read. No, I. it's basically when you're in the circle. Damn, I didn't know her. Um, his thing was there. It's when you're in the circle, I thought. Am I wrong, Cha? I thought it was only in the circles. All right. Let me go and get my... Let my doggies out, because um, they've been whining. So I let them out right before stream, but I guess they gotta go. You're not wrong? Okay, I thought so. It's in the circle, got it. All right, I will be right back. Did you get a new mic? I did, I did. Um, it's been a little while now, but yeah, I did get a new mic in a little bit, um, a little bit ago. All right, I'm gonna go and let the doggies out. So while I'm gone, I'm gonna leave you guys there so y'all can talk to TikTok. Um, and I will be right back.
Haha, <laughs> loser. Enjoy when you guys talk to each other. <laughs> I'm back. I'm back. Let me see what I missed. Oh, you guys are so cute. The emotes and stuff. Arizona, thank you for the gifted. Thank you. Thank you. No, when you equip distressing, your lunge is bigger. No, no, no. Distressing doesn't make your lunge bigger. Here, I can show you what distressing does. Um, one second. Mm -mm -mm. All right, let me ready up. All right, there we go. Um, distressing doesn't make your lunge bigger. If you look at this description here, you'll see. Um, distressing just makes your tear radius bigger. So it'll make your tear radius, which is how loud your, um, well, like not how loud, but how wide the little range of where your heartbeat is, it makes that bigger, but it doesn't make your lunge bigger. We love Twitch chat. Aw, I'm glad you guys do. That makes me happy. But yeah, it doesn't it doesn't do anything for your lunch. Oh, hold on. What else did we miss? Dreamy, thank you so much for the hundred biddies. Thank you, thank you. Never understood why people run distressing. Um basically, like if you have certain perks, maybe that um that work with tear radius, you might want distressing. For example, like say I'm running. Hmm, what could be a perk? Okay, yeah, like say I'm running Starstruck, right? Um, and I want to Starstruck as many people as possible. Starstruck makes it so that survivors will become exposed if they're in your terror radius. So maybe I can pair it with Distressing to make my terror radius bigger. That way those people will be exposed um, from a wider range. Does that make sense? <clears throat> Distressing works really well. Actually very underrated. It's pretty decent. It, it's just like more of a build dependent perk in my opinion. It's not really one of those perks that you throw on on any build and get good value out of it, you know? I thought it was good for doctor for a difficult skill check build. Yeah, it's not bad for that. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, you guys are cute. You guys are cute. I appreciate you guys talking. I think M is still in a game. Did we not die? What happened? What did I live? What did I? What did I just play? I don't even remember. Hi, Brynn. Good morning. Good morning. Anyone got into DVD because of the sidemen? What's that? You're back to Twitch? Yeah, I'm back. What do you mean? I've been here, girl. I've been streaming every day, like always, Monday through Friday. Monday through Friday. You don't know the sidemen? No, I don't. I don't, I don't. Look, y'all are so cute, bro. Y'all are so cute. <laughs> y'all are so cute. Hi, Phyllis. Good morning. Good morning. I know, Twitch showing off the emo. So y'all gotta go over there. Y'all gotta go over there. Look at the little cute Patrick. Aw. 
They got some cute emotes on Twitch. Yeah, we love it. Agitation increases it as well. Combo with distressing and starstruck. Yeah, agitation increases it. And then like if you're playing a killer like Wesker that already has a bigger tear radius just in general, then even better, you know? So yeah, there's a lot of a lot of different things um, that you can use it for. I think it might be in a in a game for a while, maybe being held hostage a little bit. So we'll play a little killer match real quick. We'll make it a quick one. Um let's see let's do i want to play artist again i don't know i've just been liking artists a lot i've been wanting to get a good pair of headphones i was curious what headphones to use oh girl i use sennheisers they're pretty expensive i'm not gonna lie um i think they're worth the money but they're definitely not like the most affordable thing ever yeah, I know I have the BRB screen. I just, I'm leaving it there so you guys talk to each other. <laughs> I think it's cute. I think it's cute. Mm -mm -mm. I don't understand why people, yeah, I know. A lot of people don't. I think it's just because it's so different looping artists compared to other, um, to other killers. So. What do you think about the hag? I do not like playing as hag. I think it's just quite boring to play as. Mish has the spirit main headphones, pretty much, yeah. The Lana Del Rey artist outfit? Girl, what is the, her Lana Del Rey outfit? <laughs> uh, I think people who like artists are going to like the new killer and people who don't won't. The killer that just came out? I don't know. I disagree because I don't... I like artists, but I don't really like the new killer like that. He's okay. I hate how he can zone in certain areas. Like if he wants to play like a shitter, he can. Where he basically holds you on a loop and just waits for his power to come back. And it's kind of annoying because on certain maps, it's hard to dodge it, you know? And then I don't know that I really like that interaction, but at least artist has to be a bit more precise with her birds. Um, Jen, thank you so much for the three months in advance. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I feel like he's kind of OP. I don't think he's OP. I just don't think he's as, as fun to play against. What PC do you recommend? I buy power is where I would recommend getting a PC from. Hi, Supernova. Good morning. Tell Twitch chat we miss them already. TikTok misses you guys already. <laughs> oh, I love that. All right, we'll go get the doggies after this game. Is he going to get overworked soon? I don't think so, as far as I know. Yeah, exclamation mark 360 for 360 tips. Do you ever do looping classes with viewers? No, I don't. Um, I don't know. I feel like that'd be kind of hard to organize and do. <clears throat> mm -mm -mm -mm. All right. I'm not a fan of RPD. Of course, anytime I play killer, I get freaking RPD, dude. I hate it here. I hate it here. I miss. Hello. Got an injury. Got a bird. I think this is a down. We heard a bestie over here. I'm going to pick up. Perfect. We baited that. That's great. All right. Wonderful. We got a couple injuries. I feel like we got good, good start to the match. Hi, Tess. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Mm -mm -mm. I took it off. I took off the YouTube reminder. Okay. We got a bird there. Hi, Peta. Good morning. Okay, that's perfect. She ran away. Perfect. Hello. Fine, we'll switch targets. He wants us to switch. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hi, ladies. Good morning. I'm here too. Hello, hello. You're back on TikTok. Hi, Amanda. All right, we'll go here. 
They altruistic? They are. They are, they are. We love a good altruistic team, right, Cha? We love that, we love that. Perfect. We stole her bubble. Ooh, I didn't quite place it. Okay, she got off that gen. Good to know. Okay. Got the bird. Sorry, there's a lot going on right now, so... <laughs> I apologize if you notice I'm not reading chat as much. It's kind of hard when uh, we have so many survivors everywhere. Okay. Let's go over here. Lock in. You're a little locked in. A little locked in right now. I hate indoor maps for artists. She is very, like, tough on indoor maps, in my opinion. So, a little difficult. Hi, MB. Good morning. Hi. Okay, we know they're over here. I would like her to stay at this loop, so I'm not going to try and place a burn. See if she sticks around. Okay. Also, two ground maps. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like I get so unlucky when I play killer, and I always get freaking indoor maps, bro. I swear. I hate it. And it's always freaking RPD. Okay, perfect. We still got the hit, which is good. You're finally a killer. I never see you as killer. Yeah, I play killer occasionally. Honestly. Um, at least I try to get at least a match in every day as killer. I find killer fun to play as. Sorry, I like messing with you. Oh, thank you, Eve. Thank you. This is why I'm impressed when people stream Killer 24-7. I'd be way too locked in. It's hard. It's honestly really hard to play Killer and um, actually like do well while also reading chat, you know? There's a lot going on. Mm, that one didn't quite hit that one, but that's okay. Okay, they popped the one upstairs. Mm, okay, we'll go over here, I guess. See if we can find someone. You get no breaks as killer? Yeah, there's just so much going on. Which I've also had people say, like, I prefer watching killer streams because there's always something happening. But I don't know. I like the survivor streams as well. I don't know that I have a preference of killer or survivor. I like both. I think both can be fun. Hi. Good job eating the burn. That's exactly what I would have done. She knew I couldn't throw it quite yet. She knows I can't throw it because I'm on a different level. That was smart. Maybe I'm giving her too much credit, but I definitely think she knew. We got the down though. Wonderful, wonderful. I prefer survivor streams for sure, really. I don't know that I have a preference. I like both. I like watching sometimes a little bit of killer. I feel like I learn sometimes from uh, killer streams. So I do enjoy that part of it. You're so good. Thank you. Thank you. I love playing as artists. I wouldn't say I main her, but I do like playing as her. Let's see if they're over there. Okay. They're getting a little a little quieter now. Let's go over here. They got the save. Hi, Jake. <laughs> Hi, Jake. Hello, hello. They do have to be more focused on the game. So I do feel like a lot of the times um, killer streamers mostly commentate on, you know, the match. Um, understandably so. Close, but not quite. Does he know that my bird can go up? He didn't care. He did not care. Okay, well. That's a down. Bro has calm spirit. I enjoy killer streams when it's not a killer I dislike or think is super boring. Oh, I get that. Hi, Leon. Hey, girl. All right, let's put you over here. Poor Jake, I know. He's cute. 
That was our pain res. We get a hit here. That's great. The bird can go up. If you angle it on like, if you're on the stairs when you set it, then yes. But otherwise, no. It, it's very weird. Like if I'm on a hill and I put the bird on the hill, um, it'll follow the path of that hill for the rest of the trail. It's, rare, it's weird to explain, but I can show you after we down the Cheryl. Mm, 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 mm. I'll take that. I'll take it. I'll take it. Wonderful. We down her twice like that. That's tough. <laughs> That's tough. I would be sick. Okay, let's go over here. Can you play hag next? I'll go back to survivor after this. All right, I'll show you what I mean by it. Um, okay, so if I'm right here and I place my bird, it's gonna go like that because the trail of the actual bird, you see, oh, hold on. See that trail that it places? That's what it's gonna do. So you can actually do that on stairs. It's kind of cool, but if I were to place it like, here it's not gonna go all the way up because the the beginning trail is what decides where the bird goes does that make sense see that beginning trail that's what it's gonna do it's cool yeah she's really fun she is i enjoy her um i know a lot of survivors don't like her but i think she's cool oh my god jake you gave me a heart attack <laughs> girl i didn't know you were there i was just showing off stairs and whatnot Oh, hi, Cheryl. Hi. Didn't know you were there. Hey. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> are you even Cheryl? Who are you? <laughs> Who are you, girl? Who are you? Get out of here, Maria. That's right. That's right. He sent the shit out of you? I know. I know. Like, girl, relax. Relax, relax. Good job, Saboing. Good Sabo, good Sabo. Too bad we have another hook. You've only played against Artist two times. Yeah, she's not super common. If you've never played as her, give her a shot, chat. She's really difficult. You're gonna be like, oh, wow, I hate this killer. <laughs> when I first started playing at her, I was like, oh, this killer sucks, bro. She's so hard to play as. I feel like people don't give enough credit to Artist because she's, she's challenging. Mm, mm, mm. Girl, if my dogs won't stop barking, I gotta go get them. Oh, you guys are just getting on a gen, huh? Just You just think you can get on a gen without my permission. There's so many different business. Oh, oh my God, Courtney. <laughs> Courtney! The way I was like, oh, I thought you said businesses at first and then... <laughs> That comment, that comment caught me is so off guard, girl. Oh my god. Good job, Leon. Good job. Wonderful. Hey. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's put you on this hook. I'm an artist main and I adore her. Yeah. Thank you, Ash. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate that. Oh, interesting. This one did not get pain rest. So which one got pain rest, I wonder? Very strange. She's probably more like over there, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> Someone was there though. You know what? I'll go for this guy. Cause he probably doesn't realize that I, uh, hey. Look, chat. Hmm. <laughs> I wanted to show you guys how she gets Killer Instinct. Remember we talked about that yesterday? How Artist gets Killer Instinct as well? That's how. She's just, yeah. <laughs> I had no idea. Yes, do not hide in a locker like that. Um, Cause it'll, it'll tell her exactly where you are. Mm, 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 mm. Where's your face? It's on the screen, you don't see it? That's weird. Yeah, I'm also live on Twitch, yes. Okay, let's kick this. Good to know, yes. I think people forget about that sometimes. We'll see if someone's on this gen. I'm not quite sure if they are, but just in case. Nah, they're not. 
Uh, AD, thank you so much for the six months. Thank you. Amanda, thank you for the eight months Hi, as well. Wish. Jen Pop, Happy thank you for the months. sub. Thank I'm you, so guys. Thank you, thank channel. you. I've learned so much from you. Someone can't see face cam. It's right above Twitch chat. Thank you. Yeah, I thought it was working. I think they're trolling me. Your face cam hasn't shown up on TikTok for a while. Really? That's weird. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, see, Amanda can see it. I don't know. Maybe you guys, your, your TikTok must be bugged or something. That's really strange. Mm -mm. Thank you, bird. Thank you. I try really hard to be as uh, fair as possible, you know? Always, always. I like your shirt. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Your TikTok must have gotten banned. Maybe. Maybe. You think so? Maybe they banned my cam on TikTok, chat. Huh? I don't know. That's so weird. Mm, 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 mm. Let's go for the Jake. Who's the last survivor? Cheryl? Oh, she can have Hatch. She can have Hatch. She can have Hatch. You think he'll expect this? Hey. <laughs> oh, I love doing that. It cracks me up. Oh my God. Okay, let's see over here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Have you ever gotten angry with a viewer? Oh, I'm annoyed, maybe. But, like, never anyone that's, like, actually a viewer. It's usually, like, trolls that maybe come in for the day and, like, annoy me then. But not usually viewers. So. Mm -mm. Cheryl, where you at, girl? He definitely got... I know, I know. He definitely got jump scared. I think so, too. Hmm. She was definitely working that gen originally. You know what? We're just gonna do this. Random birds everywhere. You never know. You never know. Okay. If I was Hatch... Oh. Well, it was on her. <laughs> it spawned right at her feet. Uh, cool. <laughs> you on killer is deadly unloopable. Hi, Wolk. Welcome in. Welcome in. That was a fun match, regardless of it being RPD. Not a fan of RPD, but it was still good. All right. All right. When are you playing Survivor? Right now. We're switching back to Survivor. Hi, Acertain. Good morning. Thank you for playing with me yesterday. It was fun. Good morning. Good morning. Mm -mm. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Ariel, are you here? I just saw your message. If you'll type in chat for me, I can um, I can do that. Um, hi, Dragon. Hi, Al. Good morning. Good morning. All right, let's see if M is back. I think M was being held hostage in a horrible game. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Why does this have a sensitivity warning? It happens for DVD streams. It's just because the DVD is considered like a adult game. Oh yeah, thank you, G. I got you. Let me redo my eye tracker. I need to calibrate it again. Um, what's the name of it? Toby. Let me recalibrate. Hi, Eva. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I'm here? Okay, I got you. I got you. Ariel, right? Is that... Did I pronounce it right? I got you. I can definitely call you that. Mm -mm -mm. All right. I got you, Ariel. Um, okay. Let's see. Let me recalibrate. Improve calibration. All right. I'm ready. So, I'm ready. I'm ready. Mm -mm. Oh, let me go get my dogs. Uh, I'll be right back. You guys be good. Oh, wait. Oh, God. I'm calibrating. Here, you guys can, can help me calibrate. Do this with me, okay? See how much you can move around. Uh, okay. I'm looking. Uh-huh. Okay. Look at each dot until it explodes. Okay. Okay. We're doing it together, chat. We're calibrating. <laughs> Looking at the dots. Okay, perfect. 
Yay, we did it. We did it. That's how the eye tracker calibrates where my eyes are looking, by the way. Um, we were just just setting it up again, making sure it's accurate. Um, okay, I'm going to go pick the babies up from downstairs. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Um, yeah, I play like every killer. I don't have the like, killer main or anything, so I'll play anybody. Um, I usually just ask chat what they want me to play and we'll play that. But today we just played a little artist game because I was in the mood. I like playing as artists. Hi, Katie. A huntress. Very cool. A Nancy duo match? Ooh, I'm down. I'm down. I'm down. If him is down. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Thirty months silly, so much into me, I'm puppy. Sad girl, and are you visiting? Puppy, I love you. I love you. I love you. Thank you so much for the thirty months. I appreciate you so much, girl. We definitely need to go visit you. Definitely, definitely. We went, we went to you first, and you came to us, so it's our turn again to go visit you. Have you got face cam on? Yeah, you don't see it. <clears throat> it's right underneath my um, adrenaline. Oh, you know what? It's because I have perks on. I'm I'm running perks, and the perk is covering up my face cam. Oh darn. <laughs> oh darn well that sucks uh, loser earlier earlier i only had three perks on so you know <laughs> you know you know i look over here is she actually gonna chase mm, she is she has aura Floods. That was floods. If you notice, when they unhooked, we could see her aura. And that's because of floods of rage. Imagine if you put a cam. I know. Honestly, back when I used to stream. <laughs> you want to know where I used to put my face cam? Way back in the day. I used to put it on the survivor hood. So you know where my little, like, Nia would be? I would put it over there. That's where I used to put it. Like, just, like, mess around sometimes. I'd make it really little and I'd put it right there. <laughs> That's so silly. Yeah. <laughs> Just a little tiny me right there on the survivor HUD. It's not I'm all ears. Oh, maybe it could have been. I thought it was when they unhooked. We'll have to pay attention. That's so fun. Yeah. It used to it used to be really funny because I'd have people coming into stream and be like, oh, my God, I didn't notice you until right now. And I'm like, yep. <laughs> Uh, maybe next time we do cam, we'll do that. We'll put me where my Nia is. I like that you don't use it. I feel like when girls stream with cams, people only ever compliment their looks. We all know you're gorgeous and you're so much more than that. Um, I don't know. I think it's cool when girls decide they want to stream with cam, you know? I'm just for anyone doing what they want to do, you know? I feel like sometimes um, people get really focused on... You know what does xyz person look like or whatever but like to me it's never mattered what my streamers look like so i don't really feel like it should matter what i look like you know but it's not like it's a secret or anything um like i said i stream with cam occasionally i did one like a month ago for our cooking stream um and uh, it's not like it's a secret or anything are you gonna play killer today i just did i just played a killer match 
I'm coming, friends. I'm coming. Oh, shoot. You're not super recovered. Okay, that's fine. We'll see. The side tracker color is pretty. Oh, good. I'm glad you like it. Nice. They got the pickup. Nice, Em. Pop off. Nice. We both got the pickup. Ooh, that was a good hatchet throw. Good try. Hi, Sigrid. Good morning. Good morning. I missed it. Yeah, we played a little artist game. It was fun. Okay. Can anyone tell me why she's undetectable, chat? Why is Miss Huntress undetectable? Pop quiz. Pop quiz. Pop quiz. Wooden fox. Very nice. Very nice. She has an add-on called a wooden fox. What that add-on does is anytime she searches a locker, she becomes undetectable for a period of time. So that's why we didn't have a terror radius there. The Huntress seems pretty damn good. She's very intimidating. Very intimidating. <laughs> oh my god, Em. You're wild. You're so wild. Nice, 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 nice. Em is doing what, chap? Spreading his hooks. As my good friend Em says, if you can spread your legs, you can spread those hooks, okay? <laughs> As you can see, I've been hooked. M has not, so he's taking a hook state. <laughs> As you all should, okay? As you all should. Very nice, very nice. Cal, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Huh? It's true. Are, are we wrong? Are we wrong? Okay. Okay, she's gonna be undetectable again. Remember, she just reloaded. See how she's undetectable? Perfect. Shiro, thank you so much for the 10 months. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. Damn, I try to hide behind that. Oh, damn. That was good. That was good. Mm -mm -mm. The perk on the left is object of obsession. Good try. Hey, thank you so much for the 100 biddies. Thank you. Citrine, thank you so much for the biddies. Um, Kaifen, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for the support. No, since her wild, she's good. She's good. You can tell, huh? A, uh, a good huntress is terrifying, honestly. Especially with, like, the buffs to her. She's very terrifying. Very, very terrifying. I don't know about those hits. Old Huntress? I think I would have made it around the corner there. Because wind-up time was just a little bit longer. But her wind-up is faster now, so. And I don't think it was floods, actually. I think she I think you guys were right. And she might have I'm all ears. So. Hi, loner girl. Alright, let's stack up. We're stacking up on gins. I keep forgetting, yeah. It's crazy that they buffed her. I felt like she was in a really good spot. And like really good huntresses would do did really, really well with her. And I didn't feel like she was super challenging even as like a new huntress. So I don't know. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, you don't know if you didn't catch the hint there, there's no cam. Never has been a cam today. <laughs> We, we've put exclamation mark cam in chat like three times. <laughs> the orange circle is my eye tracker. It was a joke. For the longest time, I thought your eye tracker was tracking where your mouse was. Yeah, a lot of people think that. No, it's actually tracking my exact, like exactly where my eyes are looking. Yeah, the squeaky toy is my dog. She's just, she's going to town. <laughs> she's going to town, girl. She's just back there. Where is she? Mm, okay, I heard her raise her hatchet. Okay, she's on stable. Good, good, good. 
<laughs> Hi, Krista. Thank you so much for the 56 months. That's insane. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. Ain't no way I've been tricked. I'm offended. I'm offended that you've narrowed down my stream to whether or not I have cam. I want people that want to hang out because they like my stream and they like my personality and they like my community. Not because they like what I look like, you know? I think that's the cool thing about Twitch, actually. That you connect on other things. You connect on the game that you play. You connect on, you know, things that you talk about, you know? All right, let's go this way. Ooh, she's gonna die, she's gonna die. Oh my God, oh my God. Bounce landing, no balance. <gasps> In with the body block, nice. Nice, nice, nice. I just gotta work this gen and hope they have adrenaline. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, Zara. I appreciate that. How are you doing, Krista? Good morning, good morning. Oh, shut up, Jen. <laughs> shut up. I'm sad Cam is such a focus. Yeah. Unfortunately, I just want to see the dog. That's why I'm asking. I have a TikTok um, showing my dogs. If you want to check it out, it's on my on my page for sure. Yeah, that dead hard. Wait, do we have a Dren? No a Dren, but that's all right. That's all right. You still have a hook state, which is good. Mm-mm-mm. Okay, he's over here. She's just injured over here, which is odd. <gasps> She's sabo saving? Oh, shoot. Oh, oh, she was cooking. I was like, oh, she's just sitting there. No, she was cooking. <laughs> she was cooking. Yeah, I wanted to do a dog's command. Do I not have one? I thought I made one. Exclamation mark dogs. Maybe I'm wrong. Let's go this way. The centrist is low key good. High key good. High key. Honestly. She's very patient too. I don't do well with Huntress because I'm not very patient. I I feel like I'm really impatient. Yeah, you do have Unbreakable. I'll try and go pick you up though. Don't use it yet. So that I can take a hit for you. Uh, loser. Okay, and when she hits me, you can Unbreakable, okay? I don't think I'll be able to heal you, but you can. You should be able to Unbreakable when she hits me and she's on cooldown. She's two years with you. Go, go, go. Nice. Okay, Sable. Okay, Sable. Okay, Sable. Okay, Sable. Ah, the Sables. Both of them. Oh, my God. The teamwork from the random Sables, bro. Are you kidding me? Oh, I love them. Oh, that was awesome. That was so awesome. Does Ian make it out? Oh, yeah. He made it to the other door. Oh, my gosh. He's holding a hatchet. Oh, you're good. Oh, my God. That was so good. Are they on PC, I wonder? One of them is. I'm going to say thank you. Dude, they were so cool. Yes. Yeah, the Huntress was great, too. Aw, they were so nice. They were so nice. Best Swift? Girl, we're not even in a Swift. Like, me and Im are, but those were random Sables, which I think is really cool. Those are literally, like, solo queue Sables. Um, so that's awesome. Yeah, it was I'm All Ears and Barbecue. Cool, 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 cool. Y'all can... What? <laughs> the way we complimented her. The way we complimented her. And she said, y'all can. Like. What? <laughs> she really hit us with. Y'all can. Girl, we. What? <laughs> we were complimenting you. And please. I can't. I can't. 
I can't believe this. I feel so, I feel so like <laughs> betrayed. I thought we had a good game. Oh my God. It's always the Huntress main suit. I usually like Huntresses. I feel like they're usually pretty cool. <sighs> oh, well. I'm guessing it said F off. Yeah, I think so too. Was that a four out? It was, yeah, yeah. They, she was a good huntress, honestly. Like she probably just, um, I don't know, maybe she's upset, over, but I feel like, you know, I don't know. I feel like she still performed well. It's not like she didn't do good overall. I feel like she did good. How do you get so many blood points? Um, right now there's a 200% bonus. 200% bonus. The Huntress of Sanaoria, girl, who are you telling? <laughs> uh, Matt, thank you so much for the two years. Whoa, Matt, two years is crazy. Hi, Corinne. Good morning. Hi, Fatal. Good morning. Good morning. Your glasses and the TikTok with your dogs is so cute. Oh, thank you. I don't wear them super often. Um, but yeah, I can show you guys for my TikTok viewers and my uh, Twitch viewers that wanted to see. Um, the dogs and wanted to see my face and whatnot again um these are my doggies and me like i said i've shown them on stream before um so this is kara there she is she's a little hairy on this one you know she usually has a nicer haircut i don't usually wear glasses either um but i was this day you know um and then i have lily which is about to show up on stream there she is okay there's lily this is the the little baby she likes to be like hugging me and she's just a mess and then kara is the jealous one see how jealous she is look at her <laughs> and she gets really jealous um but yeah those are the doggies that you hear all the time um in case you guys have never seen them before that's what they look like <laughs> uh, the jealous there yeah dude you should see how jealous kara gets she is a mess a mess a mess when i am like cuddling or making too much noise around lily she starts going crazy i found you on tiktok so long ago i think pretty early on when you started i'm so happy to yes yes matt i know it's been so long honestly it's crazy when i think about like some of you guys that have been here for that long you know and i'm like oh my god girl like i don't even it's so much it's just insane it's insane how much has changed from then to now you know in like a, a good way i literally just saw that video on your tiktok and then you just showed it again oh yeah 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 someone was asking about the doggies so um so beautiful your voice matches your looks oh thank you thank you thank you where are your glasses from they're from i buy direct it's a website little, little people Mm -mm -mm. oh yes they do they do lady they look like little beards <laughs> oh thank you so much for the hundred biddies thank you thank you i just realized you're latina yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i am cages are good for dogs um yeah my dogs like their crates they love their crate um they kara kara is she has ocd so um i don't know if i i think i've shared it with you guys for the most part um but kara has ocd so she is very particular about how she likes things done and so her crate is very good for her because it kind of gives her a space where she can go when she's like stressed out but she's funny because when she goes into her crate she'll she will sit there and bark at me until i close the door she cannot sit in there unless the door is closed and that is like so funny to me i don't know why she <laughs> i don't know why she's like that a space to regulate yeah exactly she will sit there and bark at me until i close the door because she doesn't like when the door is left open and she's in there it's really funny she's also she's very particular about things like she'll go she always has to go on the right side to go like up or down the stairs so when she goes up the stairs it's always up the right side when she goes down always up down the right side like she has she's very particular about how she does things so um her crate is very good for her love the makeup and your puppies thank you thank you trev i appreciate that my dog is so particular too more stubborn than ocd yeah no she definitely has ocd um she does like all these she has lots of little quirks to her but we love her did you know the sennheiser headphones you talk about are currently 40 percent off really oh wow i didn't know that that's awesome 
we need a skincare makeup tutorial because it's so glowy. I've done a get ready with me stream where um, we did my skincare and then we did my makeup. It was fun. Maybe we can do another one soon if you guys are interested. Hi, Tay. Good morning. Good morning. Yes. Yes, she has. That's the thing, too, Amara. Like, she has, like, a very... At my old house, I used to have a fence and yard. And she had this little path that she would walk that was a circle. And that path, literally, it turned into, like, a dirt path from where she would walk it every single day. Um, so she she's definitely very particular about stuff. Damn, I thought he was going to leave for them. My bad. I didn't mean to bring him over here. I thought he was on her because she's injured. It's odd that he didn't commit to her. He wants me specifically. Good shock, though. Ooh, hubris. We had a little doctor with hubris yesterday. Cool. wonder if it's the same one. You think it's the same one shot? All right. Speaking of dog OCD. <laughs> exactly. Telepathy. Exactly. My dog has OCD too, but he's a little sad. He chews the fur off his chest when he's anxious. Oh, no. Oh, sad. That's so sad, my Elixir. Oh, poor baby. I need to be there when we do that stream. Yeah, I did a get ready with me stream. I, I called it get ready with Mish. Um, and that was really fun. I had a good time. Ma, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Oh, no way, Erica. Oh, Huskies are so cute and fluffy. Huskies are very, very cute. I like Huskies. I didn't know that about stream. Wait, no what? My pups won't come out of the crate unless the door is all the way open. If I open it a little bit, they act like they can just they can't just push it. Oh, that's so cute, Dre. Oh, dogs are the best. Oh good, kitten. I'm glad to hear that. Does blast might make you exposed if the killer's running hubris? Um I think if you send the killer by any means, you become exposed, yes. Is that right? I and someone that runs blast mine might be able to tell me um, for sure, but I I'm not really a blast mine runner, but I would think so. Oh, for sure, man, for sure. Um, but my dog was was officially diagnosed as OCD um, as a baby. Well, a couple, you know, when she was a couple months old, um, and that's actually why I ended up adopting her. Originally, the lady that got her um, was going to breed her, but because of that, she decided it wouldn't be a good idea to breed her. I just like, she's never needed treatment or anything. She seems relatively happy um, with like the care that we give her here. So she seems fine. They doing gens? They are, yeah. They're popping gens. Yes, 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 Julie. All of my emotes are based on characters from the MCU. Wait, Dylan? What Dylan? My pug has separation anxiety. Yeah, I hear a lot of dogs honestly get separation anxiety. Um, it is definitely like if you notice anything unusual with your dog, definitely worth bringing up, you know? For sure. Hi, Eliza. Good morning. Can someone tell me a good perk when in chase with a killer? Is object of obsession worth it? If you're not confident in chase, I would not recommend it. It's not like for a, you know, a more beginner looper. I definitely wouldn't recommend it for that. Um, but if you are looking to get yourself in chase more often, then yes, object can be really good for that. Hi, Aizen. Good morning. <laughs> that sound, it makes me so uncomfortable. He's like... <laughs> I hate it. I hate it. 
Vet tech here, and a lot of pets get diagnosed with anxiety and OCD. It's way more common than people think. Yeah, I would think um, I had actually, like, I didn't really understand what she meant when she said that he that she had um, OCD and stuff um, until I actually got to know her and she started to, like, live with me and stuff. But like I said, she's very particular about how she does things. She needs to go on the right side of stairs. She does circles when she gets anxious um so she'll spin in little circles in the living room or where she might be um she doesn't like things to be messy so if there's like a random piece of clothes like m imagine like you left something on the floor like maybe you took off your shirt or something and you put it on the floor and you just left it in the middle of the room she's gonna make she's gonna do little circles around that until you pick it up <laughs> she's gonna do that um so, like I said, I feel like once I took her in and I was able to, like, give her the attention that she needed and stuff, um, she's never needed any medicine or anything. Um, but there's definitely a lot of little quirks to her that I have to kind of, uh, you know, pay attention to and stuff. Keeps you accountable. Exactly. Exactly. It's not even just that, but it's also, like, um, her circles are always to the left like she always spins left never right um like she's very particular very particular yeah no it definitely is mal for sure do you have a schedule on your twitch i can check when you're live yeah i'm live every monday through friday cat at 11 a.m eastern oops i was looking at chat we always tell the owners to know how their fur babies operate when diagnosed so i can tell you're doing amazing oh thank you nars thank you yeah, I, um, whenever I first got her, I definitely noticed way more anxiety from her and like her behavior was um, a little more, I, I, I like, I definitely feel like it was controlling her a lot more back then. You know what I mean? Um, where I feel like now, because I kind of know what she likes or doesn't like, I feel like we're pretty good at, at keeping her happy and uh, you know, keeping her stress at a good level, which is good. She has spirit fury. I should have known. I should have known. I had a doctor with this exact build yesterday. Hopefully they can get the save. Any recommendations for toys I could get to occupy my corgi? She's very active, but I have a lot of schoolwork. Puzzles are great. I have a couple puzzles for my dogs. Um, and I love the puzzles. The puzzles buy them so much time. Um, they're really, really cool enrichment tool. Lily is great at her puzzles. Um, she does a really good job and figures them out very quickly. Kara, I kind of have to help her out a little bit with the puzzles, but she also likes the puzzles. Hi, Boone. Good morning. Yeah, puzzles are a lot of fun for them. If you've never had a little doggy puzzle, um, basically you just hide treats for your dog in um, these little pockets, basically. And they have to figure out how to get those treats out. Um, and that can keep them busy for a long time. Like sometimes they have to put a shape in a specific, you know, way um, for the puzzle to come, I mean, for the treat to come out. And you know what I mean? Like it's very, definitely puts their mind to work. Um, so yeah, my dogs really like those. So. Let's go over here. Hi, Nikki. Killer's a swinger. Yeah, he's trying to get stunned because he has um, in fury. So, yeah, that's why. When a killer has in fury, they typically do that. Oh, I couldn't spin on that. The greed? I mean, I just didn't know where else to go, honestly. Have you tried putting treats in bottle caps floating in water in a cookie sheet? It's so cute. Wait, really? No, I've never tried that. I have a, quite a few puzzles that I've gotten on sale from like, um, like I don't know, TJ Maxx or something like that. What game is this? Dead by Daylight. I'm running Object of Obsession, Reassurance, Bond, and Adrenaline. I know, it's tough, Rita, with his red stain. How can you be so efficient while speaking to chat? Like paying, playing like that would take all my attention. I know it does. Honestly, like I do die more often than I should because I am talking. Like a lot of the time you'll notice I'm like 
fully engaged with chat and I'm just, you know, I don't really pay attention to what happens and I it ends up getting me killed. But I try my best and I feel like the more I practice it, the better I get at it. So I try really hard to, um, to keep practicing that skill. Do you want to snooze? No, we can go ahead and play it. The game's about over. No snooze, please, at mods. The game is about over. Oh shit, I didn't know you had done hard. Okay, we can go to the other door. I never knew dogs could have OCD. My dog has separation anxiety, so it's really interesting to know. Yeah, yeah, they can. Um, that's why the groomer didn't end up breeding her because she felt it was like, you know, she didn't want to pass on that trait. Um, obviously trying to breed responsibly and stuff. Uh, so that's why I took her in. Can I ask what OCD is? Yeah, OCD is obsessive compulsive disorder. Um, un a lot of people think that OCD is, oh, you just like things clean and you just like things where they are, but OCD can be very, um, it can really control your life, honestly. The way that you, like, it's, it's not about, oh, I like things clean or, oh, I like this or that. It is very, it's more like I can't function unless things are like that. Does that make sense? Damn, I fucked up. It can be very debilitating, exactly. And like, I notice it on my dog. Can I tell you guys something? Very interesting. Um, at my last house, I lived in a, a studio apartment and I have little stairs that go up onto the bed because my bed, it sits really high for my dogs. I put the stairs on the left side of my bed and my dog refused to go up on my bed. For, for the entire duration that I lived in that house, I had no idea why she didn't want to go um, up the stairs in that house. I thought maybe she just didn't like where my bed was. It's, I don't know. Like, I know her OCD, like, doesn't like certain things. So I just didn't understand, you know, why, what the problem was. Um, and so one day I was cleaning and I moved the stairs to the right side immediately went up the stairs and i was like oh my god i didn't realize that it's because she wanted it on the right side <laughs> you know what i mean like she would get so frustrated and i didn't understand she would make me put her on the bed and i had no idea why she stopped going up the stairs i i didn't realize that it was because of the side that the stairs were on so it's like little things like that you just kind of have to notice you know because they can't communicate it um but yeah that was kind of a bad play i mean i was talking we all make bad plays you know no one plays perfectly i think it's okay Podrías hacer un consejo a la hora de hacer los 360? Intento hacerlos, pero creo que me espero demasiado y el, el killer se me echa encima. Aparte, creo que el movimiento de la cámara lo hago un poco brusco. Y no yo... Oh, um, tengo un video, Wolf. Here. Aquí está el video. Um, 360. Aquí está el video. Ahí te enseño cómo hacerlo. Si tienes preguntas, me avisas. It's just a Billy so bad. Oh, nice. Can I type my perks in chat? Sure. Object of obsession. All right. Is him gone? Gonna eat breakfast? I'll be back. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good. Dare you to play the next match without Bond? You know what? We'll play a killer match while him is gone again. What killer should I play? Haha, <laughs> loser. Ah, yeah, exactly, Eliza. I get that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you're asking for my phone number in Spanish. Oh, stop, stop. <laughs> oh, Trapper, Pyramid Head Slinger, Demogorgon, Unknown, Trickster, Unknown Artist, Chucky, Chucky, Chuck, Trapper. Uh, I'm seeing a lot of Trickster, Trickster, Trickster. Trickster, 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 Chucky. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of Trickster. Let's do Trickster. Um, where's he at? There we go. What build do I have on him? Let me look. Okay, Darkness Revealed, Iron Maiden. Uh, mm, it's 
It's not horrible. Oh, that's fine. I'll take it. We'll stick with it. See if I like it. We'll see if I like it. My trickster's hot. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. All right. Oh. Show your trickster costumes. And this is like my favorite outfit. I don't really buy a lot of cosmetics, chat. So I don't really have a ton of cosmetics on anybody. Literally, I, I just don't buy cosmetics. I love them so much. Oh, I know, girl. I know. <laughs> uh, I know. I know. Trust me. All right. Okay. Let's see how this game goes. Oh my God, <laughs> Ika. Uh, no, M is not streaming right now, but we should have a shout out for M because M is awesome. Um, we love M here. Very good friend of ours. Um, if you guys don't already follow, make sure to follow M. But he's not live right now. Actually looking nice. This card stuff is pretty fun. Oh, good pimp. I'm glad you like it. I'm glad. ¿Qué opinas del perk invocación? No me gustó. Uh, siento que es, like, gastas demasiado tiempo ahí en el, en el basement. No me gusta. How do you counter trickster on a map like Borgo? Um, running loops untraditionally is what you have to do when you don't have any sort of like when you have a bunch of those open loops try and find walls around you that are that you can use to kind of protect yourself you know <gasps> hi elf welcome in welcome welcome chat remember we were talking about elf yesterday they're in chat today. We were just talking about you guys um, earlier today. Um, and chat was really excited and telling us how much they love Elf. So thank you so much. Absolutely. Welcome in. Welcome in. Happy to have you guys popping in. Good morning, Tara. Good morning. Yeah, we love Elf. Welcome in. Welcome in. Like Elf Cosmetics? Yeah, Elf Cosmetics, Silver. <laughs> Elf Cosmetics. Illy, thank you so much for gifting us up to Elf. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Aaron. Good morning. Good morning. Hi, Sonic. Thank you so very much. Enjoy your emotes. So thank you so much. All right. Let's see where the people are. Mm, if we spawn there, that means we probably have a survivor that maybe spawned there and one that spawned over here. But I'm going to go check over here. If they grouped up and they all spawn together, then we could be wrong about the spawn, but we'll see. We'll go check it out. Hmm. Okay, they might have all spawned together. Let's try this. Aha, they're in main. That's the only one that we got Aura reading from, so she's the only one that's near locker. What killer perks am I running? I am running Iron Maiden, Darkness Revealed, which is what showed us the aura. Um, hold on. Floods of Rage and Pain Rest. Damn, that was close. That was close. Shaylee, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Have Elf run a match with you? <laughs> You think Elf plays DVD? Do you guys play DVD? Be honest. <laughs> Hi, La. Good morning. Good morning. <gasps> you play DVD? What? Stop. No way. Okay. Okay. That's awesome. We love that. We love that. Oh, yes. The Sabo save. I'll take the one for one. Good save, Nia. Good save. Imagine getting killed by Elf. <laughs> that is so freaking cool. I was telling chat earlier how I think it's really cool um, that you guys want to, you know, work with Dead by Daylight creators because Dead by Daylight is a game that is very diverse. There's a lot of, of people that wear makeup that play this game. 
And I think that is really awesome uh, for a brand to to recognize. Mm -mm. All right, let's go over here. Thank you so much for the biddies. What is Elf? Elf Cosmetics? Like, it's a makeup brand. They also have skincare, if you've seen their skincare. Um, but I'm sure you've... Come on. I feel like you guys have had to know what Elf is, right? Ah, close. Wait. Not quiet. I need to put it away. Okay, he did the smart thing and went that way. Nice. All right, we got an injury there. We do have to get closer if I want to use my main event. Ah. I'm going to have to cancel it. Lag, thank you so much for the five gifted. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. <laughs> well, I don't know. I was talking yesterday about how I feel like Elf was definitely one of the first brands I tried when I was doing makeup as a kid and like as a teenager even. Um, just because of how affordable it was. Makeup is expensive. Same here, yeah. I remember going to Walmart and um, begging my mom to buy me stuff. So uh, I think that is so cool. Oh my God, Cyber. What vinyl? That's expensive. That is very expensive. All right, we'll just get this palette out of the way. Thank you. Okay, we'll go ahead and break. <coughs> their moisturizer is so good. Yeah, I've heard a lot of good things about their skincare. Mm -mm -mm. Let me go for Sheva. Anyone having trouble with their drops? Oh, are you having trouble? Um, did you check the link on exclamation mark drops? That should take you to uh, where you can check the status of your drops. That might help you. This map is kind of tough because there's a lot of areas on the map where it's kind of like tall and that's exactly where you want to go when you're uh facing trickster anything tall like this will help protect you all right i should be able to get an injury off close but not quite she's too far now See all these tall loops? So important for facing Trickster. Did you see my tweet about your stream? Oh my gosh. Oki okay, told me about that. Hi, Pickle. Good morning. The elf cleansing balm is my favorite. Oh my God. I always tell you guys, use cleansing balms to take off your makeup. I see so many people using makeup wipes. Cleansing balms are where it's at. Hi, Joe. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. You're a really good trickster. I have not played him in forever, forever, forever. Um, so we're a little rusty right now, but that's okay. That's why I try and play everybody because I want to try and, and do, you know, try and stay decent at everybody as much as I can. Hmm. Okay, let's go over here. Take a hit. I use coconut oil for makeup remover as instead of skin and it works great. The thing about coconut oil is that it's comedogenic, which is not a good thing, you know? Um, but yeah, I know. Everyone kind of just like uses what works well for them. I just think like a uh, makeup balm is really, really awesome. Like coconut oil doesn't work well for my skin. Okay, we'll take a hit there. The power grip primer. Yeah, 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 yeah. When I did my get ready with me stream and we got ready on stream together, um, that's the primer that I had as well. The green one. Damn, we ran out right when she was about to go down. Good job, Sheva. Taking a hook state. We like that. We like that. 
We love your community. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I feel so lucky, honestly, to have the community that I have. I have a community that gets so excited about so many things that I participate in. And I, I just think they're amazing. But, you know, I'm a little biased. I'm a little biased. I'll set they love us, chat. <laughs> it is comedogenic for already oily or healthy skin. But if you need nourishing, it's different. Coconut oil is perfect. Oh, cool. Yeah, I, myself, it doesn't really work for me. I would say I have pretty normal skin. Um, I used to think I had oily skin, but I just wasn't hydrating my skin well. Um, once I started to hydrate, I feel like my skin got so much better. Good dodges. Was that dead hard? Mm. Good job, Miss Nia. <laughs> Good job, good job. I have a question about the lunge distance and the event's blood radius. If you start swinging outside of the radius and enter halfway through, will it extend their lunge distance? I'm not sure. I'm not sure, honestly. I would think that it does based on where you start your lunge. Guys, April 20th, 40% off elf sale every year. Make sure you sign up and watch your email. It's so worth it. Really? 40% off? I was talking... Oh, my God. I mentioned this yesterday during the... Um, when we were in elf stream. I did a color analysis. I know you guys have been seeing those TikToks. I've been getting a million TikToks about color analysis, blah, blah, blah. And there's, like, all these filters on... Um, on TikTok so that you can do your color analysis. Well, tell me why... I did my color analysis and it told me I was a cool toned winter. And I was so like, what? Because most of my stuff, <laughs> I Loser. always, always buy warm toned stuff. I always buy like oranges, browns, and like any sort of warm toned stuff because I'm like, okay, I have kind of tan skin. So I just thought that's what looked best on me. But after doing that, it said I had cool tones. Um, and I was very surprised by that. So now I kind of want to buy myself makeup in those tones to see if it actually makes a difference. You and a periwinkle would be so cute. I need to try some of those colors. I, that's not usually the type of colors that I go for. So I kind of want to try some stuff. Your skin is cool tone. Really? What? Girl, I would have never, ever thought that I was cool tone. Ever. How reliable are those tests? I mean, I don't know. I think it's just fun, you know? Are you a gold or, or silver? Okay, see, that's another thing. Like, I have glasses, right? And they're gold. Um, Because, again, I thought, you know, I'm a warm tone. I should use gold. Well, the test tells me I'm a silver girly. So I need to, I need to look into trying silver, maybe? We can help you with undertones. Yeah, I need to learn my undertone because that's something that I've always struggled with. Um, like, especially with buying foundation and stuff. I, I feel like I always struggle. It's more about what complements it. Yeah, yeah. I need to learn my colors, I think. I think I've been picking the wrong colors all along. Mm -mm -mm. Because of the new event? Yeah, if a survivor creates a blood circle, yes, they do get a free coup. As long as they're in the range of the circle, they do, yes. Buenos dias, Rosita. How are you? Yes, Eve. I honestly, like, even last stream, um, when I did the Get Ready With Me stream, all of, like, my blushes are, like, kind of peachy, orangish colors. Like, all of my makeup is that color. I wear gold jewelry. I wear gold glasses. Um, so I kind of want to try out the cool tone stuff and see if that looks better. Hi, funny. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. I think I have a pink tone, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I struggle with getting foundation matched um, for that reason. I'm not, I don't think I'm very good with undertones. What benefits do the survivors get in the circle? Um, the survivors get like a little iron wheel. So 50% quieter when they're grunts and pain. And they also get um, their blood pools disappear faster. You can injure a lot of survivors with your power when you look down when they vault as Chucky. Um, yeah, same with, the, with Bubba. If you look down when you chainsaw, your range is extended as well. Bye, Miss Nia. You were very cute. 
You're playing kid. Yeah, we were playing a trickster match. Yeah, yeah, Carl. I am Latina. All right. That was fun. I haven't played trickster in forever. You guys never asked for trickster, I feel like. Or at least like majority wins on something else. You can learn your undertones by checking the colors of your veins. Okay, so what... Ha, if I'm cool tone, what color would my veins be? Is that real? Hi, Goose. Good morning. I think that's a myth. I thought that was a myth, too. Because mine are, like, blue. Oh, my God. They're blue. Wait. Am I really cool tone? Like on my wrist, they're blue. Oh, wow. Yours are green. You could be cool neutral. Interesting. Interesting. Ah, well, now I got to change all of my stuff. <laughs> I want to try out some of the cool tone stuff. That's really funny. I'm over here buying all the wrong stuff, apparently. <laughs> I've had my stuff for forever, too. I'm going to have to buy some cool tone stuff and see if I like it. Any idea what happened to Prime Rewards? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Tip goal for all new makeup? No, no. We're definitely going to have to check out that sale that um, Ali said, though. We love a good sale. Eva's the best with makeup. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to try out some more cool tone stuff. Um... I, I swore that I was warm. I didn't realize that I was cool until I did that test. You could be neutral, so both could suit you. True, true. It is Joe, it's his duo day. We need to have a stream only about makeup. Yeah, it's been a little while since we did our Get Ready With Me. I enjoyed the Get Ready With Me stream. It was a lot of fun. You don't know your tone either? Yeah, I'm gonna have to try some stuff. You know what? Like I kind of had an aha moment because um, I did the color theory test, right? And it was telling me that I need blue undertones in everything that I do, you know? Um, you can do it on our channel. Elf, you want me to do my get ready with me on your channel? <laughs> oh my goodness, that would be so much fun. Oh dude, that would be so much fun. I would love that. Yes, that would be so cute. Where am I from? I'm from North Carolina, but my, my family's from Mexico. They're from Chihuahua. That would be iconic. Um, I was about to say, when I did my color theory thing, or my color analysis, it was saying I need blue undertone, like lipsticks and blushes. And I was like, oh, is this why I've never liked red lipstick? I was looking at the, the red lipsticks that I have. They're all like an orangey undertone. And I'm, I'm like, maybe I need to get a blue toned red lipstick and I would actually like it. I don't know. I had like a, I was having a crisis. Um, it was like two days ago that I had found the, the TikTok filters that do the color analysis. And I thought it was really cool. Oh, good. Of course, Woof. The nada. Aún así veo que tienes mucha suavidad a la hora de girar, cosa que aún me falta. Sí, con práctica vas a aprender. Uh, solo requiere un poco de paciencia. I love this. Yes, I'm having revelations. I am. I think I need a, a blue toned red lippy. I need to find one that is blue toned and I'll, I'll try that. Maybe we'll get one for the get ready with me stream if we do it then. Seven, thank you so much for the 13 months. Thank you. Um, Cause maybe that's why I've never really liked uh, red lipstick before. I was probably getting the wrong undertone. I'm the same way, not knowing your cool tone and then finding the right red is amazing. Really? If you have any recommendations for a red under, I mean a blue undertone red lippy, that would be great. Try pink blushes. It's good for cool tone. Okay, I'll definitely have to try some stuff then. You guys got me all excited. <laughs> Y'all got me all excited for that. I love that. I'm a winter. I never wear gold because it looks so ugly on me and red lipstick doesn't look good on me. I've been trying to find one red lipstick, but I can't seem to find one. I think we need a blue toned red lippy bagel. 
If we can find a, a blue tone red lippy, then I think we'll be in a good spot. I think we're probably, from what I was reading, most red lipsticks have like a orangey undertone, which is not good for us. So I think that's probably our problem. Okay. This is how I loop four lanes, by the way. People are always like, Mish, how do you loop four lanes? I don't like four lanes. I loop the outside of them. <clears throat> be careful. Pinky blushes can be ashy, almost non-existent on darker skin. Um, I have like, I think I only have like um, a peach, like orangey blush. Maybe I need to try a, a pinky one. Um, but I've also heard try our O face lipstick and no regrets. No regrets. Mod, someone put that in confidential so I can remember. <laughs> Uh, so that I can remember a blue toned red. Yeah, 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 Eve. That's what I need. I need something blue toned, I think. I'm gonna try that out. Mm -mm -mm. Pink blush would eat on you. I need to try one. I need to try one. I just like, I don't know. I kept redoing my color analysis because I just could not believe. I literally just bought two sets of glasses both gold because i swore that i was a warm tone like autumn or something i really i don't know i don't know i hope you're doing okay been a while since i popped in missed you lots hi bunny i was wondering what's the best color to level up to get their perks because i want to start maining tiffany and just wanted to know because i don't have any killers leveled up yet okay so some really good killers to start off with that will also have decent perks, I would say. Um, probably Plague. She has Corrupt and Infectious, which are really great. Um, and also Legion. He has Discordance, which is also really good. Um, but those are also like just really good beginner killers to start with. Um, you don't really want to play killer without a build, honestly. But both of those killers can be really, uh, really fun to play as a beginner. <clears throat> That was a good shock. I couldn't vault back over. Save Ruby Woo too to try for lipstick. Okay, okay. We'll we'll definitely look into blue toned lipsticks. So, do you ever think you could get a bob cut hairstyle? Yeah, I cut my hair. Um, I think it's been like two years now on stream into a bob. Um, but it's been growing now. I don't know that I'll cut it anytime soon. Pain rest and Grim Embrace. Yes, artist as well. True. Grim Embrace, Pain rest, must haves. Um, actually, might start with artist, but if you're looking for a killer to play as while you get to Tiffany, I don't think she's the easiest killer to start with in that sense. But perks wise, yes, very much so. Highly recommend artist perks wise. No regrets is our Ruby Woo version. Ooh! Elsa, we love a good dupe. <laughs> okay, okay. Didn't hear that from us. Okay, I won't tell. I won't tell. <laughs> we love that. We love that. Gossip Mish, get ready with Mish would be awesome. Love that idea. Yeah, that's what we called it last time. I called it a get ready with Mish, um, and it was a lot of fun. I think we did that like in. It had to be. I think probably like February when we did the get ready with me. Um, and it was a lot of fun. So many of you guys enjoyed it, too. Buying that now? <laughs> Please. We love the dupes. We love the dupes. Oh, my God, Michael. Okay, we gotta go. This man is here. I don't like this map. This map is scary. Is he coming for us? No, he's going that way. <clears throat> I'd argue artist is the must buy killer for newbies because of perks. Yeah, but again, like if you're buying the killer for perks, yes, highly recommend artist. Um, but if you're looking to play a killer while you level up for perks, um, I don't think that she's very beginner friendly. I think she's actually pretty challenging for a new, a new killer. Um, but yeah, if you're looking for perks, absolutely, artist is the best. Let's go over here. That is so much cheaper and looks exactly the same. We're doing now. Let's go, dude. That's awesome. Okay, dead hard. 
Hey, right, I'll work on this. Oh, he knew. Stop! You keep finding me at the worst time! Girl! I thought you were gonna come in. I don't think he, he saw us. Mm -mm -mm. Hi, Ray! Welcome in! Welcome, welcome! What's a budget friendly gaming PC? I got my PCs from iBuyPower. iBuyPower is always my recommendation. Really, really, really love iBuyPower. Oh no, girl, that no one wants to see me gritty pickle. <laughs> Nobody wants to see that, trust. How come the focus that matches were removed? Um it's just hard to keep up with like a ton of redeem silver. I'm trying to make redeems that are a little bit easier for me to manage with uh, such an active chat, you know. Can you explain the whole blood ring and what's the purpose? Yes, absolutely. Hold on. Um okay. So I actually made a TikTok, but um, basically you grab your blood, take it to the little container, and then it'll create this circle. Anything that is in that circle, you get more blood points from. So right now it's 200% blood points. So if I did that generator there, because it's in the circle, I get more blood points. And it also gives you as a survivor, like a little built-in iron wheel where your grunts of pain are 50% quieter. And, um, oh God, what is this tile? Oh gosh, I don't know what this tile is. So oh, this is a weird tile. Um, and your trails of blood go away 50% quicker. Well, I'm I played horribly this game. I'm gonna be honest. We played horrible. The panic. I just didn't recognize the tile. The Yamaoka tiles are so weird. I know, I know, they are weird. I'm not a fan of this map. Yamaoka Stay is probably my least favorite realm. I know, I know. I played horribly. I did not enjoy that at all. And he was pretty good with his shocks. I think I would have liked the other side of the map better. I should have gone back to that side. Like where the four lane and the shack was. Oh! Well, RIP. <laughs> RIP, RIP. Another doctor? Yeah. My favorite map, Macmillan. Macmillan, Asylum, Auto Haven, Cold Wind. Those are some of my faves. Did you ever consider being a teacher or tutor before you started streaming? Your explanations are very clear and thorough like a teacher's would be. <laughs> Can I tell you a secret? <laughs> I, um, so I finished high school early and, um, I basically, well, I finished getting all my credits early. So I, I didn't graduate early, but I did finish all my credits early. So once you finish all your credits early, um, they basically allow you to do like extra stuff, you know? So one of the things that I did, I was a, um, there was a preschool nearby. Um, and I had the opportunity to be like a little assistant teacher for the preschool. So I worked for the preschool for a little while, um, while I was in high school. And also because I was done with all my credits, um, I got a TA position with my Spanish teacher. That was actually elf. Yes, it was actually elf. <laughs> I got a, a TA position with my Spanish teacher um, and I would essentially just teach the class um, while he would prepare because he was a coach for like a lot of different sports at our school. So he would stay busy with that stuff and he would just let me teach the Spanish class um, while he did um, his stuff. So it was really nice. It was really nice. Hablas español? Yes. Spanish is my first language. No wonder you talk to us like students. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like I I always enjoyed it. Um, of course, my gum. Hi, my gum. I always enjoyed it. I like helping people and I like um, showing people how to do things. And, you know, it's, it's very, very much that kind of... Um, I've always liked that stuff. I've always said, too, if I didn't stream for whatever reason, I would probably go into real estate. Um, I know real estate isn't exactly teaching or anything, but... I just feel like a lot of people aren't familiar with real estate and like the process and they don't really know much about, you know, there's just a lot of information that they're not aware of. Um, and especially for, for anybody that, you know, English is not their first language. It can be hard to understand all of the 
you know, all of that information. Um, so yeah, I just, I've always wanted to, to do something in that, in that field if I didn't stream. Hi, Agua. Good morning. Good morning. <clears throat> yes, 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 yes. We love Elf MB. <laughs> That's really good. I love people whose name really is just Spanish, but speak perfectly English. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, um, I spoke, we really spoke only Spanish at home growing up. So all of my English is from, you know, going to school and all that. So, yeah. Wait, what? Mitch is mad smart. <laughs> Hi, Indomitable. Good morning. Good morning. That's a huge benefit. It is. It's coming really handy um, at, you know, jobs that I've had in the past. Like, I, I went to school for criminal justice. And after my college, um, I worked at a, an attorney's office. Um, and it was nice because I was able to assist with clients that didn't know English. Um, and that was really helpful for his firm majority of the people that went to his firm were spanish speaking and it was due to the fact that there weren't a lot of firms that had someone that was spanish speaking so people rely on that a lot okay we'll go this way no killer scary i think he's scary on indoor maps specifically okay i was an attorney no 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 i was not an attorney hold on no <laughs> No, no, no. I was not an, uh, an attorney. I was his legal assistant. So I, I would basically just like, like, say you got a, a ticket or you got in trouble um, and you needed an attorney. You would call. I would set up an appointment with you. I would get all your information. So I had like a little sheet that I would fill out with all your stuff. Um, and then I'd create a file for you and then set up a meeting if needed with the attorney all that stuff take your payments all that stuff so that was that was all i did i wasn't like in the courtroom or anything um that was for the attorney to handle i was just his legal assistant i do work related to real estate so if you decide to go that path look on altera home loans at san antonio <laughs> oh, so fun. well i'm in north carolina i'm in north carolina so i don't know um i i don't see myself leaving streaming anytime soon i love streaming 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 has kind of given me the opportunity to be able to help and like interact with people in ways that I've never been able to in previous jobs. You know what I mean? Like, yes, in those jobs, I was like hands on and things like that. And I, I think people maybe don't realize how much of an impact you can have as a streamer. Um, hi, 63. But I feel like I, I mean, I get messages from you guys all the time telling me, you know, how much I've helped you with the game and how much I've helped you just like get your mind off of things every day. And just like little things like that mean so much to me. I feel very, I feel like streaming is very rewarding um, in that sense. I missed reclaim my top 50. Oh, no. Did you, did you gamble your stuff away? <laughs> Mish has also helped us find people to talk to. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think, I think streaming is very rewarding. I've made a lot of amazing friends um, through streaming and I've connected with people in ways that I never really did IRL necessarily, um, which is really cool. <laughs> Ali, that would be fun. That would be really fun. I'm not even gonna lie. All right, let's go up here. See if we can take them away from the... Hook. Oh, well, that sucks that we got hit, but that's all right. We'll go this way. Is made for this still worth it? If you're running an endurance, then yeah, I would say it can be worth it. Hi, Max. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, M is down there. I don't want to drop down and land on them. Okay, let me try now. Nice. Okay, let's reset. Let's reset. Let's reset. Oh, that's a good one, Lexus. That's a good prediction. Hi, Max. Good morning. All right. Let's go over here. You're so good. Thank you. Thoughts on perk objects uh, of obsession as solo queue? I solo queue with objects all the time. I mean, you just... It, it really depends on you and your play style, honestly. 
Aw, hi, Kay. How are you? It's nice to see you, Angelic. I appreciate you. Made for this is trash, in my opinion, unless you really want to use it or if you're good at using Dead Hard. Yeah, again, if you have uh, Endurance, then it's great. Because if you have, like, Dead Hard or something, you can activate your Made for this. Um, or even Off the Record can be a good way to activate it. Like, if you're running something like that, it can work out really well. Yeah, thank you for the gifts on TikTok. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. But yeah, I have worked a lot of different jobs. Huh? I feel like <laughs> it's because I've moved around a lot, though. Um, I've told you guys before, like all the different places that I've lived. But I've lived in North Carolina, South Carolina, Virginia, um, California. We've kind of gone all over, all over the place. Um, so I feel like we've worked all sorts of stuff. But right before I started streaming, though, I was bartending. Um... It was kind of hard to find a job at the time. It was like right towards the beginning of COVID where people just didn't know what was going on. Um, but Jock, thank you so much for the eight months, by the way. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry, I just saw that. Um, but I was bartending at a golf course. So it wasn't like I wasn't at a club or anything. I wasn't bartending like that. Um, I did like my schedule because it was in the morning. Um, but yeah, it was just like COVID kind of kicked in hard. It hit the golf course kind of hard, even though, you know, there was a good bit of social distancing that we could do at the golf course. It was still tough, you know? Um, so yeah, I, after, after that, I kind of went all in on, on streaming. Do you like Fung Min? I'm not a big fan. Why is there no heart displaying when I play? It's in your settings. You have to activate it in your settings. Is that everyone? <gasps> Dommy, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, raiders. Welcome, welcome. Have you ever visited any? No, okay. I have never been outside of the country. I would love to go outside of the country. Never have been. Um, my parents went to Mexico for like a month. <laughs> um, was it two years ago or something? And I almost went with them, but I couldn't quite get that much time off work. So I wasn't able to. Um, but I've never been outside of the country. Hi, Miss Lovebug. Good morning. Good morning. Which colors do you see the most? Right now, I feel like I'm seeing a lot of the unknown, but that's just because he's new. I used to live in North Carolina for like a month, and it was a trailer right next to the woods, and I loved how woodsy it was. It was peak Slenderman time, so I was terrified. Aw, dude. Oh shoot. Sorry, M, you scared me. I thought he was coming. <laughs> I thought he was coming. Um, I really, when I moved to California, I realized just how much I love trees. It's not anywhere near the level of like greenery and trees that you have over here. And I was just absolutely like, I, I don't think I've ever appreciated trees as much as I have until I, I moved back and I was like, oh my God, I miss trees so much. Aw, oh, thank you, Rima. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate that. Welcome in. Oh shoot, the door just started. I thought he had a little more time on it. Gabriel, take a hit. Gabriel, take a hit, please. <laughs> I just kept crying. <laughs> uh, you were in the desert, that's why? Yeah, yeah. I'm sure other parts of California um, are, are more green, but the area that I was in, girl, it was, it was tough. I live in the desert. When we moved back from North Carolina, the shock of zero trees was insane. It is, it is, isn't it? Like, it's so, so weird because living here my whole life, I never really thought twice about the trees. But once you move and you realize that it, not everywhere is like that, it's it hits you hard. It's, it hits you so hard. <clears throat> mm -mm. Thank you, Mons. Thank you. Gotta head out, but great being here. Yes, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Can't wait to get you on our channel and do giveaways for your community too. Oh my God, thank you so much, Elf. Everyone say thank you to Elf. 
thank you so much we appreciate you i hope you have a wonderful day thank you for stopping by it means a lot to me um and thank you for for giving people like me opportunities like this it means a lot thank you thank you all right let's see if we can reassure at least okay i've reassured him so i'm gonna go find you now so we can heal yeah M knows the deal i was just trying to reassure reassurance pauses the hook state for 30 seconds and it takes 16 seconds to heal so we'll have plenty of time to heal and reset before we go in for the save <clears throat> that's crazy that you mentioned this because i just visited arizona for the first time and it was like another planet yes dude it's crazy i'm telling you you don't really think about it until you experience it like that and it's like a whole different it's a whole different thing really it does feel like another planet sometimes honestly remember if you take a direct hit it doesn't damage you the way that the other ones do now because he pulled out his power i'm gonna run Ah, uh, we're dead. I was worried that he was going to teleport. See how his body's standing straight up? That means he can instantly teleport. And he moves very quickly when he teleports. It might actually be a better idea for us to take a hook state anyway. Because the timer is going down. That was so cute and wholesome how they came in and connected. I love brands that take interest like that. I'll definitely continue to buy their products. Yes, me too. I think it's so cool for... Um, I mean, you guys have seen me talk about this before, but I feel like as a woman in this space, sometimes we get overlooked. At, like sometimes gaming as a hobby for us gets overlooked. You know what I mean? So it's kind of cool to see um, to see brands recognize, hey, there's a lot of women that play video games too, you know? Not even just women, just people that wear makeup yes right ray i i feel like a lot of times it is overlooked as a hobby for us um so i that means a lot to me honestly <clears throat> yes they very much are alexis did you like south carolina my husband and i might be moving there from idaho love south carolina love 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 south carolina great place to live i would honestly probably live there again um given the opportunity Oh my god do i make this oh do i make this oh my god this is gonna be so close do we make it oh the body blocks bro oh my god oh my god good job good job oh that's so awesome dude that's so freaking awesome There's not a low, lot of women who play video games and there's a lot of women who play horror games in Sims 4. Um, yeah, no, there's not a low amount of women. Oh, yes, yes, yes. There's a lot of people. And it's not even just women, but um, people that wear makeup, you know? Um, it means a lot to me when people acknowledge women in gaming spaces, especially because gaming was an escape for me as a kid. Yes, absolutely. Um, I think it's just really cool to to see that they recognize that as a as a hobby for us um and you know especially like makeup right um makeup is something that it's not even tied to being a woman necessarily you know um it's it's people of all different backgrounds i feel like use makeup and um it's like a form of of art really and it's kind of i tell people all the time like my whenever i do skincare or when i do my makeup it's very therapeutic for me very relaxing it's very like at the end of the night laying down like i have all my skincare next to my bed and i'll typically like put on my serums and i'll put on you know what i mean when i'm like laying down and it's so relaxing it just feels like a good way to unwind and kind of give yourself a little bit of self-care so um yeah i think it's really really awesome i love that thank you so much for the roses thank you yeah there's a there's so many so many people when i look at my analytics that's another thing i'm very proud of my analytics are very 50 50. um we got 50 percent female 50 percent male in my analytics um that's all it shows me but i i love that our community is like that Taking off a full face of makeup 
and doing a full cleansing routine is the best feeling? Absolutely. Makeup has been expanding into other male-dominated areas like Anastasia Beverly Hills was sponsoring some of their F1 Academy cars, women's racing for Formula Series. Really? Oh, that's really cool. That's really cool. What if M or Mish doesn't get hooked first? Well, one of us is going to have to get foot hooked before the other, right? Um, so then whoever gets hooked before the other is, is the answer. But yeah, that's another thing, Ray. I, um, I, I, I've always been talking about how there's not just, I feel like sometimes as women in this space too, we kind of feel, I don't know, kind of like, uh, forgotten or kind of like pushed aside sometimes. Um, so yeah, it's really, it's really cool to see things like that in this space <clears throat> i thought i meant like first hook no it's okay it's okay i get it hi mira good morning good morning make us has helped me gain so much confidence in myself and gender expression elf was the first products i ever tried because they're so accessible yeah yeah same i think my first makeup brush set was from elf just because affordability <laughs> you need a stop rock hi kennedy good morning good morning is the stream lagging for anyone else? Not for me. Not for me. <clears throat> Overlooked and not as involved as men. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Do you ever watch other streams while you stream? Um, no. I focus 100% on you guys. <laughs> I think it would be kind of rude if I was, like, watching another stream. Can you imagine you guys are sitting here in my stream and I'm watching something else? While you guys are in here trying to talk to me, that would be so rude. Hi, Stick It. Good morning. Good morning. Why did I get banned from your chat? Um, because you broke a rule, probably. Yeah, that sounds very hard. <laughs> that sounds very hard to do. I don't know. I don't know if uh, I feel like it'd be a little rude. Mm -mm -mm. I know, imagine I'm just like watching TV while you guys are in here trying to talk to me. That'd be so rude. It's already hard for me to play the game, I feel like, and read chat as much as I do. Um, and then on top of that, to also add in watching another stream, girl. I watch streams on my off time, um, like when I'm not streaming, but I don't watch them while I'm streaming. Oh, really, RG? Interesting. Maybe you had your quality settings. Um, if the Twitch stream looks kind of pixely, it's probably because your quality settings are not on the right one. Uh, make sure you change the quality settings to 1080p. That'll be the highest uh, quality. Oh, you're over there. For some reason, I thought you were upstairs. Not a fan of clown. Got a new monitor seeing colors I've never seen before. Girl... A good gaming monitor can make such a huge difference. He'll commit this time. No, he didn't. Barely. He kind of committed. But we spun him. Okay, that works. Remember the bottles hinder you by 15%. <laughs> I have all i can see you too look right now he's like wow she's wall hacking how could she possibly know that where i'm at that doesn't even make any sense <laughs> oh my god that was so much aura reading there that was so good i love object i'm so happy they nerfed the visual effects me too dude me too i'm on the generator <clears throat> He has Rancor. Oh, I wasn't paying attention, to be honest. So he has the aura reading and Hender Extender. I I think I'll have to pay attention next time. I wasn't really paying attention to what proc does. Someone said Rancor, but I think it was add-ons. I thought it was the aura add-on, but I could be wrong. You've been playing for a year on console, but I'm still so bad. Do you have any tips? Um, Work on your camera control. Uh, number two, watch streamers, um, not just on the survivor side. I feel like a lot of times people get really focused on their role and they don't realize how much they're not learning by not playing killer. Playing as the killer that you struggle against is really important to understanding how their power works. If you ever um, 
even if you don't like to play as killer maybe you should watch a killer stream um to kind of get a good feel for how their ability works uh just yesterday we played a game as bubba and i was teaching chat how his charges work and that information is stuff that you're gonna use and chase against the bubba you know so it's like being able to understand killer powers is really important like obviously with clown i know that he hinders me by 15 percent so he's gonna make me 15 percent slower in the fog so i try to avoid the bottles as much as possible and um if i do get hit by the bottles i just try and play the pallet that's what i usually do against clown how many rpd games today i don't know we've had a lot huh Yeah, I agree, Anon, for sure. What if I just suck at and against Death Slinger? Well, you gotta practice. You gotta practice. Oops, sorry about that. I miss being active in your streams. I've been lurking every now and then. I'm so happy. Aw, thank you. Thank you, thank you, Jack. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. That means a lot. Thank you for lurking. Thank you for being here. Hi, Mike. Good morning. Does Clown speed boost? make the survivor faster yes so the yellow bottles are the only ones that affect both the clown and the survivors it makes him faster but it also makes survivors faster the other ones though the ones that slow you down they don't make him slower it only makes survivors slower and clown is already 15 percent faster than you so if you get hit by the bottles he's now 30 percent faster than you does that make sense all right Mm, we'll do this generator, I guess, while he sits there. If he's going to hang around mid, we'll just sit over here for a bit and let him sit on unhook so he can waste his time there. <clears throat> I was going to sub and all. I've been dealing with so much and watching what I was making. Um, my stream is 18 plus. I, as a Twitch partner, I have to uphold the rules in my stream. I'm not allowed to have people in my stream that are under 18. If you tell me that you're under 18, then I have to ban you. I'm a, again, I'm a Twitch partner. Can't I can't not uphold my rules. So, I love how you answer chat's questions and don't get bothered by people being curious about the game. Some people get so angry when chat asks questions. I honestly, people ask me like, do you not get tired of answering the same questions all the time? But I'm like, I don't know, I think for me if you guys are nice to me and you're just like genuinely asking because you want to learn like that's exciting to me i don't know i think it's fun to teach new players how to play my graphic settings i play on low tips for the unknown yes i will be making a video on him definitely yeah i love doing that drew exactly one of my favorite things about streaming if I can help you enjoy the game more if by teaching you stuff, then that makes me super, super happy. Absolutely. Hi, Slay. Good morning. He really wants to defend that gen, girl. That man really wants this generator. Maybe if we crouch, he won't notice us. You think you'll notice us, shot? Oh, my object. <laughs> uh, I can't. I can't. I'm not dropping that. Not while the pallets. I mean, not while the gen is still there. Good hit. Good hit. Look at him. He's cutting us off. Court, thank you for the 14 months. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. First time watching your stream. Love all the videos you do on TikTok. Thank you. Welcome in. Happy to have you in my stream. Thank you for coming over from TikTok. How you spin while slowed? I know, this poor man. <laughs> this poor man. I thought Twitch was 13 plus, but I don't know because it doesn't apply to me, but still. Twitch is, but Dead by Daylight is a mature rated game. When you watch any Dead by Daylight stream, it'll give you a warning letting you know that it is a mature stream. Um, and that's because it is a mature rated game. So on Twitch, you should not be watching a Dead by Daylight stream unless you're 18 plus. 
<clears throat> Hopefully they can finish it now. Oh, damn. My adrenaline was so close. That's all right. We can take a, a hook seat. What pricks are you running? Uh, objects of obsession, adrenaline, reassurance, and bond. Hi, travel. It's nice to see you. Good morning. Good morning. Mm -mm. Yeah, of course, kitties. I saw your stream on TikTok. I just started playing DVD. I enjoy playing Killer, but would you have any tips for playing Solo Survivor? Um, my biggest thing with Survivor is Survivor is a team-based role. It's not like Killer. Killer is a solo role. You know what I mean? You're not relying on other people um, to determine how well you're going to perform. Sure, you get unlucky with like RNG and like maps and all that stuff, but... Survivor is team-based, so even if you as an individual play really well, if your solo queue teammates aren't doing gens, if they're not saving you, if they're not, you know what I mean? Like, there's so many factors that are just going to end up with you having a bad match. Um, so the biggest thing I recommend when you're playing as a solo queue survivor is to try to focus more on your performance as an individual and less on whether or not you escape and and win in that sense you know what i mean i find people focus a lot on oh i lost because i died you know and that's just not you're not going to end up happy um with dbd if you focus on that too much can you yeah object of obsession allows me to see the killer's aura anytime they see my aura and if I'm an obsession for the match, um, then that means, which you can see on my username, you see that little, the little claws around my Nia, that means I'm the obsession. So if I'm the obsession, I actually get the added bonus of being able to see him every 30 seconds as well. But remember, he gets to see me too. Okay, we got her up. That could be true, okay? All right, let's sit right here. <clears throat> when you're a killer and you kick Jen too many times, what are those things that come out of the ground and block it? Does it block it for survivors, for the killer, or both? Only for the killer. That is to prevent three Jen situations and to prevent games where the killer is just holding the game for a really long time in a three Jen. Um, so yeah, it blocks it for the killer after eight times. You can no longer kick it. Yes, thank you so much for bringing that up. We are partnered with ExpressVPN this month. If you guys are interested in using a VPN service, we are partnered with ExpressVPN to bring you the best VPN. Um, we are offering three months for free on your one-year subscription. Feel free to check it out at expressvpn.com slash mish. VPNs are good for protecting your IP address when you're online browsing or playing online video games. It's also really good for accessing content that's not available in your country. Good morning, Chews. Good morning. Got you, bestie. Take the vault. Do you have any tips for trying to learn to remember where pallets are? Yeah, don't use Windows. Everyone always says use Windows. When you're new and you don't know where things are, don't use Windows. Biggest tip. <laughs> it's like, it's like, think of it like, um, you know when when you were in school and the teacher would be like, all right, guys, next week is a um, open book quiz. You can you can have your your book with you. Um, it's going to be a quiz on apples, right? You're not going to go home and study, right? Because you know you're going to have your book, right? But when you aren't running Windows, it's forcing your brain to retain that knowledge and to actually look around and to see where the tiles are. Notice, okay, this tile spawns a palette and a window. This palette, you know what I mean? Like, it's actually, you're retaining that information more and it's forcing yourself to actually look around for your resources and stuff, which is a, a really important skill as a survivor. I was the UE last game. Yo, GG's, GG's. Yeah, it's for motion sickness. It's not really a nerf. Maybe I did notice it was easier to loop, but didn't realize. No, it just like, it's for the visuals. So they made the visuals less intense. 
Hi, Tietokes. Good morning. I was watching a stream and the streamer was new to DBD and was just genuinely asking for tips. And everyone just kept saying Windows. I was the only one to say Windows might not be the greatest when you're new. Yeah, I, everyone always recommends Windows. It's kind of like the people that recommend Technician to new players. Um, sometimes I have people ask and people are like, oh, yeah, Technician. And I'm like, girl. Hi, Miss. I love watching streams, <laughs> uh, everyone. Girl. You're Wait, I'm in the wrong teacher. section. That's I've why. I've learned so much. Purple heart. They recommend this perk, chat. If you don't know what it does, basically, it makes it so that when you fail a skill check, the generator won't explode and notify the killer. It'll still lose its progress, but it also, like, adds an additional progress loss. Um, and I think people don't realize that. I don't know. It, it basically punishes you even more for missing a skill check. The only thing is it just doesn't notify the killer. But like what you're not understanding is it's just putting you in the habit of like being okay with missing skill checks. You know what I mean? And it's also kind of playing into you being a stealthy player, which, you know, that the only way that you learn how to do better in chase is by putting yourself in chase. So, yeah, I just I always tell people no to technician, no to windows. I just don't recommend it. It, it is very good, Anon. It's just, I feel like it puts people in a really bad habit on how to play. I remember my technician era. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, damn. That sucks, Panic. That's weird. I would fangirl so hard if I solo queued and joined a match with Mission M. Aw. Does Object still tell you when killers see your aura, even when you're no longer obsession? Yes, yes. That is always um, active, regardless of whether or not you're the obsession. Mm -mm -mm. I'm not polite enough to deal with some of the teammates this chat gets. <laughs> uh, girl, I don't know. I just feel like sometimes people take a, a solo queue a little bit too serious where they like they let like a bad match kind of ruin their day and ruin their attitude towards playing the game. I always learned the hard way back in the day when Spine Chill was OP. Oh, yeah, yeah. What do you think of Sable's perk Wicked? The basement unhook is situational, but the aura reading seems really good. Uh, it's all right. Uh, it's not something that I really want to run. Um, how do I get rid of ads? By subscribing to the channel. Or you can subscribe to Turbo on Twitch and it gets rid of ads site-wide. All right. I had a friend that would literally get off the game completely if she didn't escape and would complain about how bad the game was. It was a mood killer. Yeah, I think like I really got burnt out of DVD years ago whenever I first started playing. And I think a big part of that was because I was playing with people that were in that kind of um, state where they were kind of, you know, they would kind of get upset if they didn't es escape and if the game didn't go like they wanted it to. And um, I just feel like that kind of bummed me out so i try really hard to be aware i can't stand that she has no red stain mm -mm -mm. we're in a school merging match i'm sad i'm really sad chat oh, oh my god we got scanned. That's all right, I guess. We'll go this way. I guess we'll just do gens. Try and get out of here ASAP. <laughs> Try and get over this game ASAP. Skull Merchant? I know, I know. I hate it here. Yeah, someone told me that before, Carmilla. I've heard that. That it's a free. I think that's cool. I'm guilty of taking solo queues too serious, but only when other survivors start it. Ah, oh, damn. I couldn't spin. The ace was right next to me. I didn't realize. But we're on a pallet. Maybe our teammates could come by. Um, I think whenever I first started playing, I definitely maybe felt that way a bit more. Now, I feel like it takes a lot to upset me when it comes to playing the game. Damn, she knows. She knows, she knows, she knows. She picked up. 
I prefer to play versus school merchant than knight or clown. Really? I would much rather last game than this game. Me too, flower. Me too. Oh, it kind of does, puppy. That's funny. <laughs> Limon, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you, thank you. My favorite fruit, probably strawberries. Love strawberries. We got a little Mishy Berry emote. Hi, Chris. Good morning. Have you ever DC'd? Yeah, I'm sure. It, like, definitely depends on, like, the match. I very rarely do, though. Very rarely. You'll catch me DCing, like, once a year. Okay, that one's done. So we're working on this one over here, I think. Yeah, let's go start, work on this one. I hate how Skull Merchant moves. She seems like she just glides around. She does, yeah. She's very... They keep giving her new cosmetics, and I'm like, oh, why? <laughs> why are we giving her more cosmetics than people play her? Because they want to see the cosmetics. It makes me sad. Is the PC like PS5 when I play? Oh, in what way? In some ways, yes. In other ways, not so much. Nobody cares about her, right? My favorite curse word. Oh, girl, I don't know. I don't know. That's a hard one. <laughs> Lena, thank you so much for the prime. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Male survivors feel slower because they can take up more of your screen. Yeah. Yeah. I agree. They're not slower, though, uh, King. It's just like a visual. It, it looks like it, but it's not actually. All right. We're on this one. What happened to the other gen? Did it get fully regressed again? Weird. It's when you watch others play. They look so fast in comparison to yourself. Yes. People always tell me in my videos... How are you looping so fast? When I loop, I'm not that fast. <laughs> or they'll tell me like, how is your FOV so wide? My camera is much more zoomed in. And I'm like, no, girl. I promise you it is exactly the same. It's just because you're seeing it on like a little screen. You know what I mean? You're kind of watching someone. It's just like a, an illusion. Kyle, thank you for the sub. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Is she coming? Be honest. Oh, no. She's on him. Have people told you that too, Michael? I, it cracks me up, honestly. Because they'll be like, I don't understand how your survivor is so fast. What perk are you running that's making you so fast? And I'm like, girl, I'm not. <laughs> I'm the same speed as everyone else. Yeah, they do move around funny too. I don't like playing male survivors, honestly. While playing, you have tunnel vision? Yeah. Well, while playing, too, you're, like, so stressed out. You know what I mean? When you're newer, too. That you feel like the killer is, like, zooming, you know? When in reality, they're just normal. Whereas when you're watching someone, you're calm. You're not in stress. You know? You're just kind of spectating, paying attention to everything. So it's a bit different. Oh, the old movement. Yep, yep. I've had people ask me about my FOV a lot lately. Uh-oh. M is in trouble. Oh, no, you're good. Okay. <laughs> Emoji. I can't. Oh, she's here. Okay. I need to take a hook state, so I'll just take the chase, I guess. Not that this pallet's super safe, but I need to take a hook safe for him. Him's on death hook. Mill survivors have longer strides, so they appear slower. Yeah, I feel like I just don't like the male survivor movement. It just feels clunky to me. It doesn't feel as smooth as Nia does. Oh my god, that's funny. I actually think Ash has pretty decent movement, Jess, compared to the other boys. I love this map, but I feel like most of the pallets are unsafe. Um, some of them are. There's a lot of good pallets, though. I like this map. I feel like it's pretty good. Overall, not mad at it.
Oh, he's over there. Okay, that guy hasn't been hooked though, so we'll take it. Damn, I think he tried to throw a flashbang. I saw the little chase thing start. I think we need to heal. I know, cat. I'm sick too. Oh, it's unfortunate. Really don't like Skull Merchant. Hi, you want to heal? Pain res? I know. She's been getting her pain res all match. She could come around the door, so we got to be careful. It, the thing about her, too, is that she can just activate her undetectable, which is really strong sometimes. Because all she has to do is place her drone. So it's like she has full control of when she becomes undetectable. Shoot, I say stay in bed and boo, honestly. Oh, he took another hook. Stay. Okay, hold on. I'm coming with a flashbang. Hold on. Her footsteps are very quiet. Yeah, they are. Girl, it's nothing like Nemi. Let me tell you. Nemi coming around, you're going to hear him from a mile away. If Nemi's on his way, you hear him from three miles away. Okay. Perfect. Good job. I'll take it. Okay, flashbang. Flashbang. All right. Ace is in trouble. There's a pallet here. I wonder if she'll insta pick. <laughs> okay. I don't want to talk about it. I was thinking maybe she'll insta pick because, like, obviously he's on a pallet. Makes sense, right? <laughs> But I didn't know she had a Mori. She had a Mori. Oh, gosh. Oh, hi, Ace on the floor. Oh, nice bush. Oh, instantly. Did, did I did I just see him instantly die while I was still in the Mori? <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, he died, too. <laughs> Wow, good Mori cam. Yes. Oh, okay. Well, that was a match. You know, it's kind of like any Skull Merchant match. Did we really expect it to be anything crazy? <laughs> Did we expect a good match? Be honest. I can't with her. Me neither. Me neither. I know. Where can we go, Em? It's just Skull Merchant things. Uh, she's hot in that new skin. She does look good. I will admit she looks good. I just really don't like her, but she does look good in that outfit. They've been killing it with cosmetics lately. They've been putting out so many things. When is that um, other set of cosmetics supposed to come out, chat? The one that's, um, gosh, what was it called? Um, Slipknot. Yeah, when are the Slipknot cosmetics coming out? Anyone know? I'm instantly leaving match when there's a skull merchant. I don't blame you, honestly. Cosmetics are amazing lately. Yeah, they've been killing it. Next week. Oh, okay, okay. So we're a little, eh, we got a little while to go. Good to know. Good to know. It's a little while. You hit your BP cap, girl. We spent all our blood points earlier. You're kidding. Okay. Well, I guess I'll spend some on, on Nia and then we'll go back to Chucky. Oh my god, Lot, that's funny. I'm loving how Ace moves. Yeah, Ace has nice movement too. I agree. Hi Leon, good morning. The Unknown was supposed to get a free cosmetic if you bought the DLC, but they didn't give it to us yet. It's supposed to come out next patch. Oh, really? Oh, cool. Because I know they gave, um, they gave Sable one. So that's good to know. <sighs> Girl, I'm like, I'm tired. 
I thought you were P100. Yeah, nah. I've been trying to spend my blood points on Chucky. I'm trying to get him to P100, but I, I just, girl, I can't, I can't seem to get there. My Chucky's taking 10 years. Is invocation worth it? No, absolutely not. Absolutely not. No, it isn't a reward for P100, but you should just P100 me and Chucky unless you're already doing so. Yeah, I already am. Only because I promised chat. I wasn't going to, though. Honestly, if I could avoid doing it, I would. Personally, if I was you guys, um, in my opinion, because the other side can see your prestige, it's just kind of shitty, honestly. I wish it didn't show your prestige until in in game screen because people are weird about that. It gives expectations. It does. It's really weird. What happens when you're P100? You get a add a boy. That's it. That's all you get. Hi, mystery. Good morning. Good morning. Is DVD worth playing? I say yes. I've got a lot of time in this game. I love this game. I've had a lot of a lot of years playing this game. Definitely got my money's worth. You get tunneled and BM'd. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. It's like not even worth it. It's not even worth it. Exactly, Zara. I don't know. It's just so weird. People are very weird about prestige. They're like, how am I getting high level prestige characters when I'm like newer to the game or whatever? But it's like, dude, honestly, just because someone's high prestige doesn't mean that they're necessarily super experienced. You know what I mean? Once the killer sees P100, the killer's speed changes. Yeah, yeah. I wish they didn't show prestige in lobby and they just showed it in like the end game screen. I think that would be a lot healthier for the game. Exactly, Kat, exactly. I'm high prestige on a few characters, but don't feel like I personally play well on them for some reason. So I play Yui, who I feel like I play much better on. Yeah. I feel like a lot of, um, I have some friends that have pre P100 their characters and they like feel like they can't even play their main because they're like, I feel like I get tunneled way more on those. So I don't know. I don't know. Is there a prestige level that you should get to? Some benefits to different levels? Um, yes. Okay. So I'll give you the rundown on prestige if you guys don't know. So from P1 to P3, you're unlocking perks. So at P1, you unlock the level one version of the perk on all your survivors. So that means bond level one, which is like a decreased range from the level three version. Um, you get like a, like a baby level of the perk basically on all your survivors at P1. P2, you're unlocking the level two version of it. P3, you're unlocking the level three version, which is the max, you know, level of the perk. Um, so if you get to P3 on your, on whatever character, that means it unlocks all the perks for all your characters. You're not going to have to get in your blood web. It's just going to be in your perks. Um, from P4 to P6, you're unlocking cosmetics. So from P4, 5, and 6, you'll get a bloody top, bloody pants, and bloody head. Um, so if you want the bloody cosmetics, that's how you get those. And then from P6 to P9, you get the charms for the corresponding perks. So for example, if I'm playing as say Meg, um, from P6 to P9, I would get my um, quick and quiet charm, my sprint burst charm, and my um, adrenaline charm. Does that make sense? So those are the only rewards. Everything after that, after P9, is just for show. There's no reward for it. So it's kind of one of those things where um, it makes you, it, for me, I just don't feel like it's worth it to go past nine. Um, if you want, you can, sure. Like you can throw your character points in there, but I personally would recommend just getting to three if you just want the teachables. And then if you want the cosmetics to so go ahead and get to six, um, if you want the charms, go ahead and get to nine. Um, other than that, I would work more so on unlocking all the perks than anything. Thank you. Makes so much sense. Good, good. What survivor would you recommend based on the perk? Exclamation mark survivors will give you my list of perks and my opinions on all of the perks. They're color coded so you guys can kind of decide which ones you like based on that. Damn, I thought I could make that. Silly me, I should have left the pallet. 
If you're gonna get hit, don't drop the pallet. Don't be like me. Don't be like me, chat. This doctor's good with his shocks, bro. He is good. He's good. He knows the timing. We're gonna have to be really careful about this doctor. Is it true you get slightly better luck at getting better items in the blood web at higher prestige? No, not really, honestly. I mean, the one benefit to being P100 is that you get an iridescent thing in every blood web. Does it really matter that much? I mean, I don't know. I don't really care about iridescent stuff. I've already got so many items and stuff. Hi, Bonnie. Good morning. Like, do you really want a rainbow map all the time? You know what I mean? I don't notice any difference either, kind of. Besides that. But is, uh, anything else in the blood web? Not really, no. You're not really going to notice a difference. Oh, thank you, Jen. Can I explain what cleansing totems do? Um, nothing if it's just a dull totem. Like, if it's just a blank totem, it's not going to do anything besides give you boldness points. Um... But if it's a lit totem, then you're getting rid of the perk that it's tied to. So if it's like a killer hex perk um, and that's why it's lit, then, you know, you'll get rid of that perk. Are we getting another killer? We get a new killer about every three months, chop. Something like that. Sometimes it can be kind of a little bit sooner, um, but we find out usually before that because we have a PTB and the PTB is where we test everything before it goes live. And we usually test it, what, like three weeks? Um, so it's usually like we know who the killer is going to be and everything like a month before. So me too, Pickle, me too. Watching from the hatch. Hello, hello. As someone who runs through items, that's why I'm working on getting Talita to P100. I just want items. Loot, girl. Octavia, seriously, like, my collection on Nia happened just from looting. Like, I... If you want to um, collect items, level up, sure, but definitely loot, too. That's going to be the best way. Because then while you're looting, you're also, like, keeping those items with you, which is really cool. So you have items to use in the matches and um, you're also adding to your collection. Any tips for getting used to object of obsession around four wall loops? Um, I loop the outside of four lanes more than I do the inside. I find it's a lot better for me, um, a lot safer. Okay, they're good. Both of them are good. They're going the save and he's in chase. So we'll just finish this gen. I agree, Olive. I think a, a banner and a badge would be amazing if you get to P100. Like, why not? I feel like there should be some sort of reward, at least. Yeah, exactly, Liv. Exactly. Plunders is great. Isn't he good with his shock, Sim? I feel like his timing is good. <laughs> Shut up, Jen. Uh. That's funny. Why do some totems make the surrounding area glow blue? That's a boon totem. So boon totems are tied to survivor perks. Um, the orange ones are tied to killer perks. So a boon totem means that your teammate or you have lit up a totem and um, it's giving you some sort of benefit. So a really common one is circle of healing. It makes it so that you heal 100% faster in the area of the boon. Yeah, object is a Lori perk. You have to prestige her to get her perk. Easier way to find Hatch? Um, left behind, I guess, if you really want to ha find it. No, not yet, Majestic. We both had health issues, like, back to back. So we had to push it. But we'll definitely be doing it at some point. All right, let's just do the gen. <laughs> Taz. Hi, Taz. Is it Michaela main? I'm still salty about the circle of healing nerf. Why? It's still a really good perk. I think it's really nice. The 100% um, healing speed is awesome. I think people were just selfish and just using it for themselves. But if you're using it to heal each other, that's an insane healing speed now. I don't really consider that much of a nerf. Damn. He came over. 
He's good with his shocks. So I feel like M might be in trouble. <gasps> Never mind, because he has dead hard. Dead hard. He said in trouble. In trouble. Who do you think I am? All right, we'll go over here. He understands his shocks really well. He knows when he shouldn't continue to spam his power. Oh my God, I couldn't get it that time. I guess I gotta go this way. Whew, that was close. <laughs> he is scary. He is scary. I have a question? Of course, Pickle. Of course. Good morning, Rick. Good morning. God, he's, he's very good with his shocks, I feel like. That loop was nasty? Yeah. He was very scary there. Thought he was gonna hit me. Good morning, Cam. Good morning. I had to like really focus on when my um, effect went away at the right time. They are hen for sure. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay. Maybe we should just heal real quick. M is on. Okay. M is on hook. Cheryl seems like she's going for the save. So maybe I just go over here and heal. Hello. What do you think of in-game perks when in pubs? Most of the time you don't even get there. I like in-game perks, honestly. I don't mind them. I, I run adrenaline all the time. That's why I refuse to pee 100. Yeah, I think a lot of people um, really think too much of P100. It really is not as big a deal, you know? You're not really getting much of a reward for it. Okay, they went down. Any major changes? Lots of changes. I, re I definitely recommend reading the patch notes over the last six months. Hi, Osalinas. I tested out your tips on PC and I was doing so good. I escaped all my matches, took chase, and used your tips. Thank you. Oh, good. Good, good, good. I'm so glad to hear that. That's awesome. It's nice to see you. I'm doing good, Psycho. How are you? Good morning. Good morning. We got two gens pretty much done. That's good. I should be able to pop this one. That's great. We went from four to two, and we can take Chase here from in because he's on death hook and I'm not. He's gonna go back to the hook. Okay. If if the other girl is not going for it, which she's not, I'm just gonna have to run in and reassure. I don't want a one for one and give him a free hook if we don't have to, but I will go and reassure her. If we can buy the team time, that's a lot better than us trading. Is this a real pallet? It is. Good. See, now he wants to camp that out. Okay. I don't mind trading. I just want to buy us a bit more time before we trade. If we can. Nice, good dead hard. Nice, 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 nice. That's perfect, perfect, perfect. Nice. As long as it's not someone that's on death hook that gets uh, hooked here. And now if they just stack up on a gen, I can get my adrenaline, we should be good. You're so pleasant. Hi, Ghosty, welcome in. Welcome, welcome. I recommended my friends to watch your stream because they saw me getting better at looping. Really? It's because I watch your channel and give a lot of insight on tips on DBD. Good, Ryan. That's such an awesome compliment, honestly. It makes me happy when you guys are noticing your own progress, you know? Because I feel like for me, it's really hard for me to notice my own progress until I actually look back at clips and stuff. So I always tell you guys to like, take clips and um like really look back on your old clips to see how much you're progressing because it does help a lot you'll you'll notice big changes that way Aw, good i'm so glad 
I've also been sending my friends your guides to help them when oh when they're new. Thank you. Thank you, Penelope. That means a lot to me. I'm really happy that you guys find my stuff helpful, you know? Okay, I need them on a gen, girl, but. Ugh. Oh no, this guy is pretty good with his shock. Cheryl's coming in. Nice. Okay. Oh, yeah. If M does the gen and Cheryl stays body blocking, then that's great. We should be in a pretty good spot. Looping with friends. See, we love solo queue teammates that help out. Oh, shoot. Now he's on M. M's on death hook. Cheryl, go help. Go help him. Go help him. She didn't get the hint, girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hold on. The other reason I stopped relying on life, I got so much better after that. Good. Good, good, good. See, I'm telling you, I tell people all the time about life because I feel like it really is so common, girl. The amount of times that I see it um, used, like, the wrong way. Absolutely. Hi, Meg. Good morning. The Cheryl was awesome for helping us out. Hopefully she does the generator while we loop. No, do you have pop? No, he has pop, bro. Oh, that's tough. That is really tough. Break the pallet? Yeah, I figured. He knew I was a little zoned there. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good, princess. How are you doing? It's nice to see you. Hello, hello. Okay, she's back on the gen. Good shock, good shock. <laughs> the way this man is waiting! <laughs> it bleeds! Okay, he's gonna slug for the 4K. Well, um, I mean, mm, I don't think she finishes it before he gets over there because of Merciless. He has Merciless Storm. Yeah, ah, that sucks. Did he wait your dead heart? He did, yeah. He did, he did. Me and my boyfriend stopped life after your videos. Oh, good, 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 good. I think it's fine to like go back to it. I don't think there's anything wrong specifically with life. I just think when you're not confident in your looping and you're not a strong looper, it's better to learn without it and then go back to it, you know? Uh, Mr. Wurst, thank you so much for the sub. Thank you, thank you. But you might find that you're like me and you, you don't even want to go back to it, you know? Um, maybe you like something else by that time. Hi, Bewitched. Mr. Wurst, thank you so much for the sub. It means a lot. I appreciate it. And now, I'm going to tell you guys the best part about Doctor. The best part about Doctor is that because she's tier 3, even if for some reason, from some miracle, she's able to come to me, she's not going to be able to pick me up because she's in tier 3. So, we love that about Doctor. <laughs> Yay! I've always said I, I feel like they should change it so that he can she can pick up. She just can't heal somebody. You know what I mean? Because I feel like that's different. How do you know exactly where I was? Are you watching my stream? Be honest. Spin in a circle if you're watching my stream. Be honest. I can't even see him. <laughs> be honest, be honest. Deer stalker? No, because my object would have been active. I don't think it was active. Mm -mm. Did I have a little a little body next to me? I don't remember. The hot spawn? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Merciless, barbecue, pain res, and pop goes the weasel. 
I only have six survivors left to buy before I have every character out of Ellen, Renato, uh, Talita, Ada, Gabriel, and Jonah. Who would you recommend getting first? Um, here, I'll show you guys what I have here. Um, oh, he did have a hallucination. Gotcha. Just weird that he decided to hunt me and nobody else. Um, okay, so I have a thing that I made for you guys. If you guys are like trying to figure out who you want to get and you just don't know, um, it's personal opinion, so you might disagree. Um, but I made like a graphic for you guys so that you guys can can decide. This is how I recommend you level, and it's all based on I try to take into consideration characters that you um you know can get for free and stuff so that's how i did it um that's kind of where i put them and it's all based on their perks again it's just like the best perks you know um all the way down to like the lower end obviously there's some kill some survivors here that have good perks but it's only like maybe one perk so it's like is it worth it to get the one perk you know so obviously they're gonna be graded lower than someone that has like two or three really good perks um i haven't added sable and i haven't added alan so those you'll notice aren't on there but um basically each color defines like my opinion um green being like a really good perk yellow being a good perk but uh, maybe it's like for a specific play style orange is a perk that i don't recommend going for right away because it's probably going to be a perk that depends on other perks so think of perks like head on right head on you're going to get way more value out of if you run it with like quick and quiet something like that you know where it kind of requires other perks to be considered really good um so i did this for every character so you'll notice i have dwight and i have his perks graded um then we have meg again perks graded um i kind of again it's niche and that's why it's orange orange doesn't necessarily mean it's a bad perk um but it's just niche so the red perks are perks that i recommend you not use um and then yeah so they're all graded i have all of the survivors listed on there and you can scroll up and see all of them or scroll down um but yeah if you ever want to access that it's exclamation mark survivors in my in my chat and you'll be able to check it out through there um, and this is all my personal opinion so you know you might disagree with some of the stuff or you might agree i don't know um but again orange doesn't necessarily mean it's a bad perk you know orange just means that it might be a perk that you want to use with like a very specific build or you know what i mean it's not necessarily that it's going to be a bad perk for you to get for example like i really like breakout i actually really enjoy running breakout but there's no sense in you getting yui and getting breakout if you don't have something like i don't know saboteur or you know what i mean something that's gonna kind of synergize really well with breakout so yeah that's kind of that's kind of my take on it all right do you have a killer tier list? I don't, not at the moment, but I, I do want to work on one because people have asked for it. Is there one for killers? I don't. Um, you guys can't do exclamation mark survivors on TikTok, but if you do it on my Twitch chat, you'll be able to access that. Unfortunately, there's no commands on TikTok, so it doesn't let me put links in there. <clears throat> kind of annoying, but what can we do? But yeah, if you guys ever have questions about specific, like who do I level or whatever, um, that might be a good list to uh, to refer to. Distortion is green and red. What's your opinion on that? Yes, distortion is green and red because it's green because it is a strong perk. Um, it might, you know, help you escape um, in the sense of like the killer maybe not might not be able to find you and things like that. But I label it red because I don't recommend it. Um, distortion is a perk that can hurt you indirectly um, and hurt your team indirectly. You might not realize it. For example, if you have a killer that has two aura reading perks, right? And you have a team where two survivors have distortion and the other two don't. What's going to end up happening is they're going to keep getting barbecue and chili on the same two people. They're going to keep getting floods on the same two people. And guess what? Those two people are going to end up getting chased more often and getting um, found more often because 
that's like who like why waste time looking for the distortion player when you already know where other people are you know and you might think like i don't care about my teammates but you should because the longer your teammates stay alive the more likely you are to make it an end game so it's still hurting you um you shouldn't be what running perks that hurt your team as a whole you should be running perks that um that help your team you know why do you recommend boil over i don't recommend boil over does distortion work with object of obsession no they cancel each other out does object still tell you when killers see your aura even when you're no longer obsession because i keep getting friends till the end and them not having aura reading perks apart from that yeah it'll even if you're not the obsession it still shows you their aura if they see yours wait pancakes have you been trying oh Oh, why don't I recommend boil over? Um, boil over is a perk that really just punishes new killers. Um, you might have luck running boil over if you're in like low MMR, kind of like low, maybe you're newer to the game and you might get value there. But any killer with any sort of time in the game knows hook spawns it hooks spawn very close together it's not really worth the perk slot um it doesn't take much as killer it, i seriously will run you know i play killer and i literally barely ever get affected by boil over if i do get affected by boil over it's maybe because um a teammate is helping out or something like that um i don't i don't recommend running it being the obsession means um, every game, someone is chosen as the obsession. You can see my name has the little arms around it. Um, that means that I'm the obsession. And the reason that I'm the obsession is because I'm running object. So it increases the chances for me to be the obsession. Um, but even if I wasn't running object, you can still be the obsession. Hold on chat. I don't know what's going on with my dogs. What in the world? I think my dogs are outside or something. Hold on. I'll be right back. Okay. I, I think my dogs somehow got outside. <laughs> um, maybe my door swung open or something. Uh, so I have to run downstairs real quick. I'll be right back, chat. Okay, sorry about that. My dogs, the wind is insane today and my dogs somehow went outside. I don't, I don't know. Ah, I'm back. Ah, Pupper's on the loose, yeah. I was so distracted while that clown was chasing me because my dogs, I could hear them outside. Oh, he's a tunneling clown. I see. Didn't realize we were playing that game. Oh, that sucks, dude. <clears throat> have you ever escaped a match against the Myers with a tombstone? I'm relatively new. I've never seen it happen yet. Do you have any tips? Yeah. You can avoid getting tombstone by going in a locker. If you feel like he's getting close enough that he can tombstone you, just hop into a locker. He has iron grass, so he kind of plans on doing this. Tunneling at five gens, I know. How did they get out? I think the, I must have not shut the, the door all the way earlier. And um, it's so windy outside today. I think that's what happened.
Is there a benefit to hitting people directly with battles as clown? Um, if you have pinky finger. If you have pinky finger, you'll expose the survivor if you hit them directly. I'm gonna be honest, M. I think I'm gonna die. I didn't realize there was no opening there. Fuck it. Go this way. He's breaking. He's being stinky. He is, yeah. He's being annoying. He seems to have lost us temporarily. A heal would be ideal. <sighs> no one doing gents. I think they were trying to help me because they're tunneling so hard. Oh, dude. It went struggle on first hook, dude. That sucks. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I'm good, Visa. I promise. Why don't you recommend dance with me? It's not a good perk. If I put it in red chat, that means it's like a really bad perk. <laughs> like, I think a lot of perks when you're new sound good, but it's cause like you're still learning the game. You know what I mean? Um, Once you understand the game a bit better, you'll kind of get a better idea of how it works. Does he have? Why am I exposed? Hold on. Did he have pinky finger? And I didn't notice it was starstruck? From how long ago? That was so long ago, wasn't it? Oh, it was friends? Oh. Wait, was it friends or was it start? No. Friends doesn't last that long. It was starstruck? Really? Interesting. That's why he has iron grasp. So that he can travel longer distances on the map and expose more people. Star Trek rug before he hooked that guy who was near you. Interesting. What does expose mean? It means you're one shot down. This killer is um, playing for money chop. We don't stand a chance when we face killers that are playing for money. <clears throat> Their family is being held hostage if they don't 4K in Dead by Daylight. It is only the right thing to do. Yeah, I don't care if you farm me, honestly. the worst map for us to get against clown because the there's not like uh some of the pallets are really unsafe um and his bottles are gonna slow you down at windows and stuff i hate killers like that me too me too when i was new to the game i used to think exposed was where they know where i was at i know i don't know why they call it that honestly i thought the same thing why call it exposed it makes you feel like they just know where you are it doesn't feel like you're one shot down. <laughs> yeah, you dropped the pallet. That's hilarious. Oh my God. Mm-mm-mm. Petition to name it naked. <laughs> oh, rename it naked. Imagine. I thought exposed did both. Nope. Exposed doesn't show where you are at all. It just shows. It basically it doesn't show anything. It's just um, it's just something that um makes you one shot down. That's all. They be acting like they get paid per 4K. I know, like, brother, we are at four gens. Do you really think 
that somehow we're gonna escape <laughs> what are we worried about be honest tells them where you are and also makes you one shot no 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 it does not tell you where you are does not reveal your location that is a very different status effect exposed only means that you are one shot down that's all Yeah, exactly, Millie. I was freaking out for nothing. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> uh, how many of you guys didn't know that? Be honest. He has a Wawa. That's why he was carrying the survivor around so much. I see. So he has Starstruck, a Wawa. He probably has a full backpack build. Hi, Rachel. <laughs> this clown girl. I didn't know. Girl, don't even feel bad about it. A lot of people don't know. That's why we learn together. That's why you're here now, right? So we can all learn and talk about things together. Yeah, like, what am I meant to do on an unsafe pallet? This is such an unlucky map. Did he bring it? No, one of the survivors brought it. That sucks. Um, he wants me to not wiggle so he can close hatch in my face. Oh, me, oh, my. Is it petty if we just sit here? <laughs> you tunneled all my teammates. Well, now you want to be nice? Now you want to be nice, girl? You're going to tell me you tunneled. All match. Played for money. Slugged me. Uh, slugged me for the 4K. <laughs> for what? To be the nice guy? <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah, I thought so. <laughs> I can't, bro. I can't. Wow, what a nice guy. Guys, he gave us hatch. Really fun game. Really fun game. Really fun game. <clears throat> oh, man. I come back into stream and see this if it wasn't like just like the build the the play style you know i'm just not really a fan i love a petty queen uh, yeah, what a phenomenal gaming experience. Exactly. Are there chew toys? Yeah, my doggies are going crazy. Can y'all hear the squeaks? <laughs> I'm sorry. My doggies are going crazy right now. My dog also has a squeaky toy and it's been tripping me out. Oh, really? <laughs> She's going crazy. She loves her squeaky toys. She she will just like go to town i have a toy bin um i have a toy bin in in the room and they just go and grab their little toy every now and then and then just go to town they love it what do you think the best build is for a baby survivor um it that depends on your play style honestly i can't like give build recommendations because i don't know how you play like how i play is very different than how you might play you know what i mean um, did Karen Lily's emotes get taken down? Um, which ones? Maybe. Yeah, I don't have any emote slots right now, Visa, but I'm getting some new ones made. Your old mic would confuse me. Yeah, it sounded like it was right next to you. I know. <laughs> it did. It did. Can I join, Mish? I will do anything. I'm not doing open lobbies right now. 
Oh, that's cute, Erica. I love that. What do you think about Made for This? Um, Made for This is... Made for This is uh, kind of whatever, you know? It's like... It's good, but you definitely need it with like a perk that will activate it. Like if you run dead hard, it's probably going to be really good. It, you're going to get good value out of it. Um, but if you don't... Oh, thank you. Um, then maybe something... Uh, it's just like you're... Unless you can activate it, I don't feel like you get max value out of it. Uh. Oh, yeah. I move them around. Why do you call it a backpack build? Because it relies on the killer having the survivor on their shoulder. So if you guys want me to explain the build that that clown had, he had Iron Grasp, Starstruck, and Awawa. So Iron Grasp makes it so that it takes longer for the survivor to wiggle. Um, and Awawa is a perk that allows you to see any survivors within 20 meters of you so they'll see your aura so as he's carrying a survivor on his shoulder if he walks by other survivors um he's gonna see their aura so usually they'll walk around until they see someone and then they hook someone and then now they're affected by starstruck which exposes them it makes them one shot down um so yeah, that's what his build was. That was kind of what he was relying on. I call it backpack build because it relies on him having somebody on his shoulders. Um, yeah, awaken awareness. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Jacob. <clears throat> oh, finally a good map. Rancid Abattoir. Ooh, a lethal ghosty. Hi, ghosty. I see you, girl. Who are you sucking? Are you sucking them? Be honest. Stop. Stop. Okay, we revealed him. <laughs> oh, remember, he gets killer instincts when you reveal him as well. So keep that in mind. Um, now, I'm probably about 99% stocked. So I'm going to try and take a hit. Because I don't want him to sneak up on me later. Mm -mm -mm. If you take a hit when you uh, when he's got good stock progress on you, then it resets your stock. So because I knew that he had stocked me quite a bit there, I was probably 99. I don't want him to just like sneak up on me and get a free exposed down on me. So I'd rather take the hit there and run away. That way he can't sneak up on me like that. Do you have space for one more? I'm not doing open lobbies right now. <clears throat> I love playing against Ghostface. I don't mind Ghostface, but he's not one of my favorites. I, I know a lot of people really love going against him. I can't remember the name of the song, but I swear his music sounds like a classical waltz. Oh, really? They changed it not too long ago. I feel like he's only had that song for a little while. Nice! And took a hit for Talita because she's exposed. Nice. We got a spin off as well. Now Talita got so much distance. He's going to kick the gen, which is unfortunate. Okay, sorry about that. The dogs are barking and I didn't want uh I didn't want them to bark in your ear chat. They probably still will bark, but it's alright. <laughs> they stopped barking as loud as they were at least. Damn, good hit, good hit. Mrs. locked in. No, no, no. The dogs were barking. I was not locked in at all. I was trying to get them to shut up. <laughs> I was not locked in. I just muted. Aw, thank you, Sable. Thank you. 
I was like, Kara, stop barking. <laughs> Love your channel. I'm here from TikTok. DVD is my favorite game, so I'm always looking for ways to improve. Thanks for the advice. Oh, good. Good, so fam. Welcome in. If you don't mind me asking, how much did your first setup for my power come to be? I think it was like a thousand bucks, uh, my first PC, um, which isn't the PC that I currently have. What's the difference between Myers and Ghosty? Both have undetectable and are stealth killers. Why enjoy Myers more than Ghosty? Because Myers has a universal stock meter and Ghosty has an individual stock meter. So because of that, I don't enjoy Ghostface's mechanics. Ghostface will um, be able to 99 stock you and then sneak up on you and get a down on you. Myers can't do that because of his universal stock meter. Yes, he can set up his universal stock to 99, um, but I much rather deal with that than I would with Ghostface. And Myers can only stock you a certain amount. There's a cap to how much he can stock you. So once he exposes you so many times, he can no longer do it again. Um, Whereas Ghostface can expose you a million times a match, you know? Yes, I did. I did. Um, it's 200% and it goes all the way up to 400% now. Visa, thank you for gifting us up to Eve. Thank you. I think I missed that earlier. And Visa, thank you for gifting us up to Sofa. Thank you. Thank you. Are you mainly just a survivor main? Sorry for asking. No, don't be sorry. Um, I played both. I played a little bit of killer earlier, um, but I mostly play survivor. Mm -mm -mm. Um, blood pack day or which one was it? I didn't notice it. To be honest, M can take a hit because he's not stocked. He's probably gonna cloak now. So I'd like to reveal him. Talita is there as well. Oh my god, he's got the, the scary movie mask. That's funny. I didn't even realize that. <laughs> uh -huh, I don't ever see Ghostface use that mask. The what's up mask? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're funny, Kay. Oh, okay. Yeah, she is running Blood Pact. Yeah, it's not a super common perk. I think it's better for um, playing when a Swift than it is in solo queue. Any shampoo can do... Uh, no, I'm not very into hair, to be honest. Um, I probably am, like, the worst person to ask about that. What's Blood Pact? Blood Pact is a perk that gives you a speed boost with the obsession. So like if they heal me and I'm the obsession, then as long as we stay really close to each other, I'll get a little haste. See how right now me and this girl, if we stay close together, um, we'll be faster than normal. So we're just gonna stick to this Cheryl. You wanna go over there? I'm gonna stay close to her because again, you see that haste on the right hand side? As long as we stay within a certain amount of meters. So. Yeah, I think so too, Kay. Hi, Barely. How are you? Good morning. So because I'm the obsession, I would be their blood packed. I'm meaning nurse currently, but it's so hard to be survivors in the house maps. Do you have any tips? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's kind of any sort of two-story maps can be challenging as nurse for sure. Um... I mean, the biggest thing, I guess, is just like, I see a lot of nurses try to predict where the survivor is going to go. I think the, the best thing to do is only blink to where you last saw the survivor. That's what I would recommend. And then it's like instead of predicting, you know, instead of predicting where they're going to be, just blink to where you last saw them. Um, and then as far as like just general tips for it, um, I highly recommend using only one blink for mobility and then once you find a survivor and you're actually chasing then use two blinks because if you only use one to get around your cooldown is going to be a lot shorter whereas if you use two um it's going to be a lot longer dodo thank you so much for the five gifted thank you eric thank you for the biddies as well thank you so much thank you thank you i appreciate that dodo thank you so much I love this Talita. 
Okay, girl. Okay. All right, let's go for the save. Is your hair naturally straight, wavy, or curly? Mine is naturally straight. Very straight. Girl, I can't get it to hold a curl to save my life, honestly. Horribly straight. I've been running for the people buckle up, and it's been so fun to see the killer stand there. Yeah. Yeah, it's so strong. Honestly, surprised that more people don't run it. I have curly hair. See, I wish I had curly hair. I know it's a, a more maintenance alley, but I think that curly hair is so beautiful. Uh, I've always wanted curly hair, but that's how it is, you know? When people, when you have one thing, you want the opposite. It's just because that's how you've, you know, that's what you're used to. Mm. Okay, we'll just go over here. Oh, thank you, Tony. Thank you. Have the straightest hair on the planet. Me too, Hex. Me too. Curly hair people want straight and straight hair people want curly. It's a cycle. Absolutely. It's always that way, I swear. Come here. <laughs> All right. He's coming. He's coming, girl. All right. Talita's going in. Stop, Ghostface. All right. Oh my God, Im. The body block with Dead Hard is too funny. Okay, he's going back. Oh, nice. We're going to go to object value. Oh my God. So much. Holy. Did you see how much aura reading I got there? <laughs> that was long. Okay. He's on M, maybe? Or who? Where'd he go? Oh, he's on you. Okay. M's dead hearts are always on point. I know. What do you think Sable's salty circle? Oh, do you think it's worth it? Um, no, if we're being honest. I, I've i tried to think of, like, situations where it would be beneficial. But honestly, I can. I... I I think it's such a waste of time, if we're being real. Nice, we got the reveal. That's good. He has flood, so when when we get the unhook, he sees. Nice, good job, team. All right, we'll buy time for him, just to make sure that he makes it out. Object means you see him when he sees you. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Is object long because of lethal? Yeah, I think he had floods and lethal. If I have to guess this build based on object. Yeah, he had floods, lethal. Oh, he also had barbecue. Yeah, he had a full uh, aura reading build, which is cool. They were good. They were so fun. Love them. All right, all right. I think we're gonna go ahead and call it there um, for a Twitch and and TikTok and everything. I'm gonna go. Um, I think we're gonna keep streaming, but I'm gonna be streaming on Nice. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and call it there. If you guys don't follow M already, we love M so very much. I don't know if you want to keep playing M, um, but Oki, okay, I thought maybe we could play together if you're down. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna just go stream on Nice. If you guys want to hang out with us, we will be on there. I'm not gonna be streaming on on TikTok or anything. Um, so if you guys want to come and hang out, feel free to do so. Um, the link is right here. If you guys want to check it out, it's also in my panels. If you guys want to check it out on there. Um, but yeah, it's up to you, Em, if you want to keep playing as well. I'll probably play for a couple hours. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. It is rare. It is rare, rare, okay, honestly. Can you be on nice on mobile? No, you can't, unfortunately. Do you guys want me to stay on TikTok since it's not available on mobile? Would you guys prefer that? Uh, do you, are there like mobile viewers that want to watch? Um, yes. 
<laughs> okay, if you guys if you guys want me to stay on TikTok, I'll stay on TikTok then. Okay, okay, okay. I'll make sure to stay on TikTok. Um, but if you're on desktop and you want to watch, the link is right there. Uh, so feel free to join us. But I'll be streaming for a little bit longer on there. But I love you guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. And I hope to see you guys on the next one. Love you guys. TikTok, I'm still staying with you guys. And same on Nice, okay? Just give me a second while I end my YouTube and my Twitter.